not at all. Not but uh, I, I think, uh, I think that <laughs> I everyone, uh, no. you know, you I'm can say what you want. Uh, but, uh, I need stream, so I don't know. How, you know, but, uh, I don't know yeah, it's fine. Joint winners is fine. Same. Fine, guys. Fine. Thanks for coming, Neil. Uh, thanks for coming. Uh, yeah, I just want to do start the stream. Yes, after Anish. Guys, I would like to say a few things. So, yes, thanks and come. Uh, let me go to the YouTube studio and look at the status of the stream right now. I think I'm live already. Yeah. So welcome back. Uh, welcome back. Uh, I'll just get a few uh, things on OBS set before uh, I start up. I start uh, talking about the. Uh, on the stream about chess or anything else. So let me get the chat on OBS first. Yeah, so the, I can see the chat now on my OBS. Great. Check. Yeah, yeah, I know, I know, I know everyone would be on Anish channel. I'm also on Anish channel. I'm also watching. I just have the stream on, so uh, they can all uh, come right here after the Anish stream ends. That was the idea. We have some exciting matches in uh, St. Louis today, yeah? starting, uh, starting with this uh, Ali Reza Magnus, which is uh, something always uh, to look forward to. So Armageddon is going on in uh, Anish channel. Yeah? Hi Rishul, hi Manav, hi uh, Ashrit, Sanjay, Raghav, Mukda. The good thing about uh, having less people on a stream is you get to uh, address everyone personally yeah it's one of the unique things we have right now Hariya. Thank you, Aditya. Yeah, Max is good. I think I think all the players playing on Anish channel are uh, quite strong. Um, but Sankal tends to get a bit nervous initially, and sometimes he has uh, uh, some bad days. Uh, Deepanshu, uh, I think Nihal had some uh, problems with the scheduling when the camp was going on. So the St. Louis games are underway. Uh, is the volume a bit low? Maybe I can... Uh, first I can maybe uh, bring the mic a bit closer. Vinit, I have no idea which tournament I am playing next or anyone else is playing next.
Is it really an Anish raid? The other stream is over, is it? Ah, thank you, Anish. So which which game uh, which game should we look at first? That's the first question. Second, uh, which board color would you guys prefer? Because Anish said uh, the board that he was watching on was a bit dull, but uh, this seems a bit more preferable for some people. But maybe not the ideal one, yeah. Well, you guys you guys uh, come up with a unanimous suggestion of one board, and I'll change it to that. Thank you, Anish. For some reason my uh, YouTube studio isn't updating uh, quite properly. Okay, everything set. Uh, OBS set. Zoom also set. In case uh, someone joins, I think the audio is fine. And the board color, uh, you guys, let me know if you have a specific board you prefer, or uh, we go with the present board. Okay, so the games today, uh, Hare Krishna is playing Jiang, who is one of the most uh, promising juniors in the world right now. Uh, I think Ali Reza Magnus is definitely the most exciting uh, game for me in this round. Apart from this, we have Grishchuk Domingos, Nepomnishi Wesley and uh, Aronian Hikaru. Which is also, I think, pretty exciting. Uh, both the players are extremely interesting. Uh, Netherlands beat India. Like, An did Anish beat Nihal in the Armageddon? Wow. Le let me let me try uh, let me try a few different boards and let's see how it works. But everyone's asking for uh, different. Uh, everyone's asking for different boards. Yeah, someone says blue. Someone says green. Someone wants a black and white, which was not uh, uh, so well received in Anish stream. So I'm not sure really. Light brown or blue? Okay, let me try. Let me try to uh, see what are the possible. Boots. Something like this. Nah, this I don't like at all. It's the blue is just too bright. This is what we have. I think uh, this is a bit... Yeah, uh, we talked about going green in the previous stream, but I think we are not referring to the color of the board, no? Nah, this doesn't look great. Yeah, I think this is the board, uh, this is the safest color.
we can change it to maybe here as well this is dull yeah which one is metal yeah this is metal uh, but people are saying it's some people are saying perfect some people are saying it's dull so i mean i'm as confused as you guys know i think we'll go <laughs> i think we'll go with this for today yeah this is the ag board this is what the elite players have and i think we should follow this cool not not my favorite board but yeah i think it's better than the previous one okay so let's see what's happening on the chess part and uh, maybe i just bring the a file a bit closer yeah Yeah, the evaluation bar, right? I thought something was missing. Right? I think it should be there now. Yeah, AG has a slightly different texture, so I thought I should uh, distinguish myself a bit. I don't know why the evolution bar is uh, not showing on OBS. I think I may have uh, cropped it a bit. Yeah, now we have the evolution bar, the beloved evolution bar. So let's start with uh, Ali Reza Magnus, uh, F3 Nimzo Indian and Prabhat, uh, there are a lot of different links where you can see the uh, tournament table. One of it is uh, the chess 24. Yeah, so C6 and now A4, uh, I think this is already a very strange position. It's already a completely new position. Uh, yeah. Completely new position and as you can see Magnus is thinking for a long time already, yeah. Yeah, that seems like a very good uh, improvement Piyush, definitely. A4, Queen A5 and now what's going on? We can't get uh, uh, chess 24 standard board on leeches, no? Or can we? Thank you, Venkatesh. Yeah, yeah, uh, AG has the Zoom link.
and uh, a bunch of people have the zoom link so they are free to join in at any point uh, i had to take some time away from the i had to take some uh, time away from the screen to set up my zoom and stuff which i had in before the stream today <laughs> no we cannot have football stream uh hari krishna i'm not sure i think he's better at rapid than blitz so i'm not really sure if he has a better chance at uh, blitz so let's uh, look at some uh, different games right now i think the magnus game is going to go a little bit slow uh grischuk domingos and i'll put the hari krishna board uh, on the permanent side hari krishna has this typical uh, position which comes in uh, the modern opening so basically uh, this modern opening system is with the pawns on d6 g6 a6 here one of the ways for white to play is uh, he starts with h4 so as to provoke h5 so if black goes uh, h6 then f4 otherwise white goes h5 himself and opens the uh, king side and uh, f black plays h5 then uh, this g5 square becomes weak which is very accessible to the white knight but you don't go knight h3 right away because of bishop h3 so white waits till black either plays bishop b7 or knight d7 and then uh, goes uh, so you see here he plays bishop b7 with the idea of b4 attacking e4 and after h f3 knight d7 knight h3 now this knight sits on g5 which is a very nice square so here again uh, white waits for black to castle before opening up with g4 and uh, black also defers this with as normal developing moves as possible so e6 long uh, king b1 queen e7 finding a square for the queen and then after queen f2 knight b6 uh, bishop d3 the other knight goes to d7 queen g3 is uh, a strange move something uh, i don't understand uh, ah i put i'm keeping it all on the smaller board yeah i'm sorry i completely messed this one up i uh, i thought i was doing on the other board yeah so queen g3 is the last move Uh, i don't quite understand the idea of this move what why hari krishna is playing this because one of the things is if uh, black castles now g4 is not coming immediately the second thing is uh, um second thing is i really don't see any action happening on g6 or f7 so why exactly are we going uh, queen g3 yes uh, sandeep uh, i wish someone uh, did that to me as well well piyush but uh, not a bad idea to get the subscription no it's not that expensive right Vishal uh, would love to do a private IPL stream, but I don't know if it's uh, practically possible. But interesting idea. Abraham, uh, it's a pretty complex question. Um, it would uh, it would take quite a bit of time to explain. Okay, Piyush. Okay, so Queen G three. Oh, uh, Jiang is spending a bit of time. Thank 
थैंक यू शोरूम ओके सो हाउ आर द अदर गेम्स गोइंग एनी एक्शन एनी एक्साइटमेंट इन एनी ऑफ द गेम्स सो फॉर मैगनस अली रजा मैगनस आई हैव नो आइडिया वॉट टू मेक ऑफ दिस ओपनिंग आई डोंट नो वेर इट वेंट सो सी सिक्स इज सी सिक्स इज नॉट वन ऑफ द मेन मूव्स एंड आई एम गेसिंग अली रजा प्रोबेबली वॉज ऑलरेडी आउट ऑफ बुक हेयर सो ही प्लेज ए फोर विद आइडिया ऑफ विशेब ए थ्री क्वीन ए फाइव क्वीन डी टू इज जस्ट एन इंक्लूशन प्रोबेबली मैगनस और माई फर्स्ट थॉट इज टू कैजल हेयर बट फॉर सम रीजन मैगनस वॉन्टेड टू एट दिस क्वीन इफ आई क्वीन डी टू बिफोर कैसलिंग ग्रिशचुक सीम्स अ लिटिल बिट बेटर जतिन आई एम नॉट रियली श्योर वॉट शगुन मीन्स बट थैंक यू फॉर द सुपर चैट नवतलस Prabhat, uh, I don't know why the computer is uh, showing Queen J3 as inaccurate, but uh, the move just feels odd in uh, all possible angles. Um, first of all, uh, yeah. So first of all, uh, White generally wants to play G4. Yeah, Anish might uh, join for a while, although uh, he might not st stay for the whole time. Ah, Shagun means good luck. Okay, thank you. That's uh, Hindi or uh, Akshat? I'm not sure which platform they are playing on. Maybe the chat can answer this. Yeah, B four is the move expected from uh, Jiang. So now uh, knight E two is forced, and maybe C five. It feels like uh, it feels like black is taking over. Yeah, knight E two on the board, and now C five also on the board. Yeah, it feels like black is definitely taking over, and uh, pretty curious. Uh, Maybe uh, maybe uh, Hari Krishna intended to do something against the d6 pawn, but I just don't see how this bishop moves and gives the rook access to the d6 pawn. It uh, beats me. Abraham, uh, see, uh, I'll tell you. Uh, let me ask you a question have you read this uh, book uh, godfather or uh, have you watched the movie uh, yeah dimitri i think grand prix uh, grand prix is a very interesting opening against the sicilian e5 okay okay this is the point i see this is the point and i completely had uh, no clue about this move so e5 now let's say black takes d now is some knight into f7 on that uh, perhaps this was the whole point of queen g3 so he saw that uh, black was doing some b4 knight into c5 and he probably wants to hit on f7 so this game is starting to heat up just like my laptop yeah so uh, to analogize uh, uh, chess playing second uh, with the godfather i would say uh, a second is something like a con uh, conciliary you know it's like what tom ha hagen was to uh, vito corleone or Mick, uh, michael corleone basically they just take care of a lot of different things everything the don requires 
what the dawn requires it it depends on uh, each particular dawn it's not the same for everyone prabhat uh, as for the variance the no castling or uh, pawns reversing or whatever i don't think it's going to uh, it's going to gain much popularity anytime soon because uh, i think 98% of chess players they play the existing variant and uh, they enjoy it a lot the problem is only in the top 2% where chess is played at such a such a very high accurate level that uh, there is a lot of draws and uh, as such i think it's not it's not going to be a change that will be uh, easily accepted kalpak uh, there are uh, so many faces uh, so many faces in indian chess so many uh, lovely players and lovely coaches uh, many talented players in the ecosystem out there so uh, i think uh, we are just not going to run out of this anytime soon uh, the pandemic will uh, end much sooner than we see all the faces of indian chess Uh, yes, Utkarsh. That example, uh, I think that analogy works perfectly um, during the Olympiad. You know, uh, Vidit was giving me instructions and I was uh, executing it at the lower level. And uh, sometimes I advised him as well. Uh, Tejas, I will let Anish answer this question. Caracon or French, which is better? it uh, it's a question you really should reserve for uh, anish in his streams anirudh financially i think there are opportunities for everyone not just the elite players but at every level i think there are financially opportunities uh, it all depends on uh, how we make of the opportunities Vishal uh, Anish made a course on French on chessable, but his second made a course on uh, Karokan. So I'm curious which way uh, Anish should go. The board is not frozen; it's just that Jong hasn't made any move. Or is the board frozen? I'm surprised if that would be the case. Ah, it's frozen because I made some analysis moves, yeah. Like I made this knight and f7 move, which I was uh, speculating on. and on the right you have uh, jong thinking maybe it can be uh, edited a little bit better yeah this uh, board it can be a bit better yeah i think now it's a little bit better uh, van campen he may have been he may have worked with anish i'm not so sure I heard about the Rappo game, but I still haven't. Uh, uh, I still haven't seen this game actually. It looks like a very good game. There are uh, some people in the leeches chat saying that engine bar in the stream is a huge spoiler. Do you guys agree? Because uh, if you do. a uh, very welcome to remove ah so i have a guest on my stream hi harshit hi ashwinath how are you doing i'm good i'm good let me get you on the obs first
Yeah, it's not easy eh, to set all this OBS. Well, it takes it takes like uh, thirty seconds for me right now mm-hmm. to get it on the canvas. Should be a uh, faster. Uh, should be more automatic with a little more practice. Yep. <coughs> right now our cameras are quite big, but if someone else joins, I can make us both smaller. Yep. Okay, you're there, but uh, yeah, I can. Yeah, so you're there. Hi guys. Uh, so, what are we looking at, Srinath? Yeah. So to introduce you first, uh, Harshit was this uh, very strong hiem that uh, Anish did not want to have in a stream today. <laughs> <laughs> uh, for the Netherlands versus India match. So uh, did uh, Netherlands end up winning or? Uh... I think so because uh, Nihal finally said that. Uh, sorry, Anish said that if Nihal wins the final thirty second games, then it would be a draw. But uh anish managed to save it he managed to draw yeah ah so it was an armageddon is it yeah of some sorts yeah i mean 30 seconds okay 30 seconds each or what was the format yeah 30 seconds each and if nihal wins both the games so it's more like two armageddons ah okay So I was disappointed that I got you first on. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Yeah, but that was an amazing stream which Anish had today. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Some high quality chess. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Anish is coming up with uh, very good ideas. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah, so uh, I was just going through all the games in general, and especially uh, focusing on uh, Hari's games. Mm-hmm. And uh, I don't since he's the this... only Indian player, yeah. Yes, he's the only Indian player. Yeah. And uh, I didn't understand this Queen G3 move first of all in Hari's game. What do you think? Did you have any idea? I'm just looking at it. I mean, uh, first of all, uh, I'm surprised that Hari Krishna played Queen D2 and not G4, which. Uh... Karwana played in Bundesliga. That was just an amazing idea. On move five. Really? Okay, I had like, no idea. Like that was such an amazing idea. G four. Mm-hmm. I think it start. I mean, this G- fifth move G four was mm-hmm. developed by Dominguez, if I'm not wrong. Uh, I, yeah, Dominguez played it against Chigaev. Yeah. Yes. 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 Yeah. 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 Uh, good so thing Queen... I have the opening explorer on the chess. <laughs> okay. <laughs> yeah. And so the idea is just simple. You bring the bishop to g two and push h four h five. Yeah. Okay. But yeah, he chose queen d two, and we are at a different position. Yeah. We, yeah. Yeah. Live... I think uh, what he played was. Uh... Somewhat more standard. Yes, uh, it's probably yeah. It's just a classical way to play this, I guess. Yeah. Knight h3, knight g5. And... Yeah, it was a classical way to play until this point where he played this uh, queen g3. Mm-hmm. Which, On move fourteen, uh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Which I didn't really understand. Mm-hmm. And then after that, it felt like uh, it just feels a over. bit counterintuitive to, I mean, play queen g3 to avoiding g4, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's like exchange queen at any cost, yeah, to put it too crudely. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, he wants to go into the end game with youngsters, yeah. With anyone actually, Hari has yeah, been doing is... this uh, since forever. Mm-hmm. <laughs> But uh, this seems, uh, yeah. Yeah, so queen g5, rook f d8 is the life position that I have on my board. Yeah. There are trade-offs. Yeah, uh, black seems to have a good center, but his king can get a bit loose. Yeah, after something like g4. But how? Or do you keep the queen, or do you exchange the queen? I guess. White might want to keep it like that so that if black takes, then he takes with the h pawn. 
or right yeah so g4 uh, also because yeah. because if you take then f5 might be an idea but whereas with g5 you never have f5 because you just take n percent right yeah 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 but what move does white make that is very important does he does he think he is uh, ready for g4 immediately or um uh, i can maybe do something like knight d6 mm-hmm. someone is saying uh, levon's game is uh, hotter yeah. than my laptop right <laughs> let's, let's see yeah levon is uh, two pieces down oh oh and so if the pe- for the people who have seen uh, hikaru's expression in gibraltar <laughs> Yeah, I think Hikaru must be doing some fancy expressions here. Yeah, 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 yeah. No, but this looks this this actually looks scary for Black. I don't have the objective evaluation of this, but no, the objective evaluation is the universal evaluation. It's zero point zero zero. Ah, yeah, of course. But then in that case, oh, Nakamura has fifteen minutes. Is this preparation? No, but it's a twenty-five minute game, yeah. So. Hmm. Okay. Yeah, I think practically Aronian has really good chances, but it might just peter out. Yes. If uh, if what if Black plays something like tries to exchange the queen and give one piece, I think finally we will get a position where White will has have H two G two F two pawns and uh, an extra piece in the end game. How? Oh. How exactly? Hmm. I. It's just looking at something like knight f five, for example. Ah, uh, uh, Harshad, they are saying there's some uh, audio disturbance from your side. Okay, just give me a second. Yeah, I think that can be fixed. Yeah, yeah, sure. So you are sure this is basically a tournament with uh, ten very strong players. Uh, Divya, it's not a good idea to come and say bye, good night, because uh, once you come, people will want to have you here. Yeah, they wouldn't want you to let. They wouldn't want to let you go, and uh, you would have to end up disappointing people inevitably. Um. So I did close my window. I hope it's better. Yeah, now. yeah. I think it's better now. Yeah. To me, it feels better. Yeah, so it's ninety four. I was looking at something like knight f five, for example. Ah, but knight f five actually is a blunder. Now that I look at it, how is it a blunder? Because takes on d eight and take on e six. Okay, it's probably. Is it fine? Then bishop c six. Yeah, d into e six. Bishop c six. So knight f five. Oh, knight f five. What's the move? Hmm. Knight f5, queen d8, and then takes Rook on e6. Yeah, takes on e6, bishop e6, then knight g5 check. Okay, I see what you're saying. And then yeah. finally knight e6. So, but instead of uh, instead of uh, bishop into e6, maybe bishop c6 and black actually sort of holds on to the piece, I guess. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So knight f5 maybe not the not the best idea to exchange queen. Yeah? Maybe start with d6 if that makes some sense. Okay, I'll just put it on the board. Hold on, yeah. Knight mm-hmm. f5, queen h5, Samia's thing. Knight so f5, and... Divya, what what do you think? This seems uh, totally like Divya's position, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Divya is really good at meeting opponents. <laughs> yeah. So knight f5 or d6 is also a problem, it seems. Yeah, queen g5, knight g5, king g6. Yeah, but then again, yeah, black probably plays bishop c6. Ah, and then here is rook d6. Wow. Where, 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 where are you going? Knight f5. Uh, then d6. You are saying right immediately. Yeah. Queen and then g5. if bishops. No, queen no, g5. Queen g5. Knight g5. King g6. Right. That that is. Double. Tries to hold. But then knight e4, and I we get the position I was talking about. Ah, yeah. Knight e4. Uh... Bishop e6. 
96 and we get this trade off of white having three pawns for a piece yeah but i think after 94 there is some move because the bar is totally uh, towards black mhm i'm still not sure which move it is it's uh, tempting to look but uh, i uh, <laughs> i don't want to look yeah we can uh... yeah but nakamura will definitely burn some time here yeah meanwhile uh, chat is also free to try and find uh, what yep move. our chat is quite strong <laughs> yeah our chat is actually quite strong yeah we have saumya we have divya yeah both very dynamic players <laughs> yeah actually this was a cool line knight f5 d6 bishop c6 and white has rook into d6 That that is Saumya's line or is that is it? Saumya is saying uh, knight f five, queen h five, king d seven, knight d six, knight d six, d six, bishop e six, queen e five check. But now queen wow. f six it continues. F two is hanging. Yeah, so uh, then you have to take on f six, I guess. Yeah, and what uh, do you think about that position in general? Because. No, I think if queens are off, then black should be doing very well because white's pawns is going to be a little slow initially, right? And uh, black's rooks will, I think, uh, and also having a bishop would help a lot. Yeah, 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 like, yeah definitely. With a knight, white probably is still fine, but with a bishop, black is definitely on the better side of whatever it is. Yeah. Uh, queen g three, she's saying. Mm-hmm. Yeah, queen g three. But okay. Oh. Uh, He took on d five. Wow. Knight into e four, e into d five. So the point is, knight into d six. Just knight f five. Yeah, Devya, that is the same. Uh... Variation we were just seeing right now, yeah. Queen h5, king g7, 96, 96, queen e5. Also, what Saumya had suggested. Mm. Thank you, Sunil Kumar. Thank you so much. Uh, if you are looking forward to learning some serious chess, uh, of course, I would love to explain as well as I can. But you should also check out uh, Ganguly's channel, which is, I think, the most. Uh, Serious YouTube chess channel I've ever seen, mm-hmm. with uh, fantastic content throughout. Yeah. Divya, In the meanwhile, yeah, you are a bit late uh, on everything compared to Saumya, uh, but okay. <laughs> <laughs> uh, good thing is you do think I like. Yeah. He just gave a piece directly with e d five. Yeah, e d five knight d six. Uh, now he wants to exchange the queen. Yeah. Somehow, Black's like knight is to queen. just exchange the queen. Yep. And uh, maybe knight f five now. Yeah. May actually, uh, white might just want to peter it out somehow. Like, try to find a perpetual even. Okay, not no, sure. No, I'm not that. sure. I'm not sure. Like knight d six. Uh, knight d six, which would obviously be taken. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Did we are triggered? <laughs> no, but I don't understand her comment. I'm not late in one thing. Age, she's saying, but that is the <laughs> exact thing she's late in. No, seventeen years yeah. later. Yeah. Yeah, that is true. Uh, Divya is your coach in a lot of things, and Nihal is my coach in a lot of things. Mm-hmm. It's except in chess. Yeah, in chess also. <laughs> yeah, in chess also. Yeah. Yeah, especially in chess. Yeah, I think other things I I have I may know a little more things than him. Mm-hmm. May is precise. <laughs> yeah. 
uh, Harshit, someone is asking if you will play the Samai Raina I am Vitational. Uh, I'm not exactly sure of the details, but if it is happening, I would absolutely yeah, love yeah, to play. Yeah, it's happening. 30th September, it's happening. Uh, mm-hmm. 3 plus 1, 10 rounds, I think. And wow. the top 8 qualifies to the knockout on uh, 1st October, which uh, has 10 plus 0, I think, 2 games. And oh, 10 plus one, 0? Yeah, 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 yeah. Wow. So, so, I would love to play it also. That is some serious uh, chess, yeah, if 10 plus 0 is there. Yeah, yeah, but um, uh, first thing is to get to the top 8. Mm-hmm, definitely. But I think, I think you have very good chances. Yeah. Yeah, but you never know, yeah? Yeah, yeah, you never know because the competition is uh, very high in Mm -hmm. uh, India. So, you played Knight G6. Thank you, Shashank. Shantanu, uh, Saumi has already started streaming. And uh, she did a very nice stream on Bishop and Knight Mate today. And uh, tomorrow is going to be something uh, much more complex, which I'm also looking forward to learn. The Troitsky line on Double Knight Endgame. Yeah, I saw she was uh, flaunting her knowledge the other day on stream. <laughs> yeah, um, she was a bit, uh, she, f- she felt, she said she felt a bit embarrassed that she made a mistake there. But to be honest, uh, I think, uh, like I knew absolutely nothing about it. My knowledge was... Uh, Double knight versus king, draw. If there is a pawn, there might be some winning chances. And it ends there. Mm-hmm. And Samyo, uh, I didn't even know what was Troitsky line and stuff. And Anish and Samyo are like, Troitsky line, A5, B4, etc, etc. And I'm like... Yeah, yeah, yeah. I was uh, a lot less clueless when they were talking about Lenore. Actually, this yeah. also happened in a classical game, if I'm not wrong. Or a very high high level game from Karjakin versus, uh, I think, Ziong or Sam Sevian. Uh, oh, sorry, ah, not okay. uh, Karjakin was uh, Karjakin was the one with two knights, and if I'm not wrong, he managed to mate even. Who Karjakin? Yeah, yeah, I think so. Yeah. Yeah, I'm sure you're more up to date here. By the way, I think uh, what's happening in the game? Is there any update? Yeah, so knight g6, queen h5, king g7, and now ah, the okay. storm has sort of cleared. Although very complex. Knight d6, knight g6. Queen h5, king g7. Yeah. Uh, so now rook d5, queen h4. And it makes sense, yeah, that he put his knight on g6 to prevent the e5 square which Somme and Divya were getting in their lines. Yeah, 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 yeah. Harish By the way, Srinath. Huh? Yeah, Harshit. Uh, are you a fan of IPL? Uh, I wouldn't say I'm a fan. Mm-hmm. Uh, but yeah, I mean, no. if the games are not going with scores of 200, 250 and stuff, then I would love to watch. Really? Yeah, yeah, if... because I, I like a bit of contest between batsman and bowler. Mm-hmm. But if it's like stick cricket, you know, who hits more pitches, <laughs> then no, I just feel it's uh, bad for the bowlers. Right. Imagine having a variant of chess where white wins in every game, yeah, like. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But there might be some positions in chess 960 yeah, which just give white a huge advantage. Uh, theoretically, yes, but uh, practically... I to prove think, it, uh, it's too difficult. Yeah, yeah, yeah practically in the games that have happened so far, I don't think white had any huge advantage in any of the games so far. Yep. People are saying Hari is winning. Wow. Ah, Hari indeed has an excellent position, yeah. So this... Yeah, I... I mean, for Hari, the life go. I mean, the I mean, it's very simple for him. He just needs to exchange the queens, and yeah, then it's. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, for example, we would try to look at some safe position where we develop our pieces. But for him, he just needs to exchange the queens. That. Yeah, queen g three, queen g five. I mean, yeah, <laughs> this way, changing the queen is like uh, incredible. I don't think anyone would have uh, thought of it. 
No, but do you see? I mean, twenty fourth move, knight on b eight, and if somehow black could play bishop e eight, that would be epic. I mean, <laughs> no, but uh, Jeffrey just lost the thread somewhere. Yeah, knight c eight, knight b eight. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's too fast. But actually, it's very difficult. Yeah, because he can't move any of the pawns on the king side. If he moves f five pawn, e six will be a target. Uh. Mm, I don't but, see any uh, other pawn. After point. knight d6, he could have played f5 or uh, bishop c4 was coming, is it? But still, I yeah, bishop c4, fate. knight f8. You mean, yeah? Yeah, bishop c4, knight f8, or knight d5. Probably he had to do it, good or bad, because now it looks like Harry is just up a pawn. Yeah, it looks like uh, Jeffrey just took his pieces backward and allowed White to sit on nice, nice squares. <laughs> yeah. No, the knight on d6 is a pure monsters. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And for those for those who don't know, it is sort of on an outpost, which means that it can't be attacked by a pawn, and it is also defended by a pawn, which sort of adds up to everything. Yeah. Wow, he goes f five now. I guess it's a little bit too late. Devia, don't blame me. I huh? blame Saint Louis. They are the ones uh, collectively uh, ruining our sleep schedule. Yeah. Uh, so what were you saying? Knight d6, f5, yeah, it's on the board. Mm -hmm. But now, I mean, even the e6 pawn looks so weak. At least before there was a pawn on e5 to shadow the weakness on e6. But now it's just. Uh... Yeah, but now uh, at least uh, this uh, g3 knight is badly placed mm -hmm. and kind of stuck. And uh, true, true. Black pieces are at least getting some space for their pieces. Yeah. Yep. White might think of trying to win something. Yeah, exactly. Of course, knight b7. Trying to uh, play concrete chess. Yeah, I think he just wants to like white is a pawn up already. And uh, I guess the rookie one, king f7 will happen now. I think. King f7, knight d6 check comes. Yeah. Yeah. Hmm. Yep. Yeah. Actually, king f7, even some moves like knight e2 might not be totally out of question. Because you can actually uh, rook b8 go knight d4 and uh, support the knight on b7 indirectly. But if I uh, take the pawn after knight e2, like knight c4? So, oh yeah, then you go rook e8 and the knight on d5 is protected. True. Yeah. Still, the the e5 g5 squares are just so juicy for the knight to jump on. Yeah. Can't get there though. Thank you, Shashank. <laughs> Although I'm not. <laughs> <laughs> that doesn't. <sound. laughs> yeah, but thank yeah, you. Yeah, I'll take that compliment uh, platonically. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Yeah, but why is Zhiyong thinking? King f7 is the only move. He took knight c5. Wow. Don't believe this works. Wait, actually, is this... If you take with the bishop on c5, aren't you just lost? How? 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 Bishop c5, bishop ah. c5, rook e6 here. No. Yeah, ah, knight because knight f4 but... is there, yeah. But still, yeah. uh, white has a very good position, I think. Yeah. So, do you take with the bishop? Uh, he took with the knight. Makes sense. He'll probably just trade everything, take on e6. Yeah, and uh, be a pawn up, yeah, on one side. Yeah, and he goes knight f4, which I was a bit scared about after rook e7, to be honest. But I guess he just wants to play rook c8 and pretend everything is under control. Right. Vishal, uh, these kids are not supposed to know my sleeping schedule. Huh? I used to make them believe that I slept much earlier than I actually <laughs> slept. Don't doubt it for me on YouTube.
Yeah, but Jeffrey, I guess, made a practical decision, yeah, to give up on God. But uh, get some counterplay, yeah. Yeah. But I actually, like now, like the G six pawn is just. Oh, hmm. uh, Magnus has already beaten Ali Reza. Wow. So incredible, the. <laughs> but uh, just one thing is quite uh, peculiar in both of these games that. Both of the players are playing youngsters, and both of them have the queens off. Yeah. <laughs> both uh, Magnus and Hari. Yep. I hadn't seen uh, how Magnus won, but uh, I think it was uh, uh, Ali Reza basically just didn't know the position after six to move after c six. Yeah, c six. I have never c six is a bit new. Yeah, so that's one thing you can. Uh, Well, wow, this is a surprise against your uh, future uh... Ninja mm-hmm. F3 surprise. Yeah. But I'm not uh, fully sure of how uh because it's sort of I mean C6 that gives away some dark squares yeah but there must be a very deep point behind that obviously. Yeah, we need Anish to take yeah, us through this. Yeah, to decode interviews. Yeah. Decode this yeah. nuances. No, very smooth game. Very smooth game. I I think he just won from the opening. Yeah, he just understood it better. Sri <laughs> Nand get exposed. <laughs> Well, yeah. uh, nowadays it doesn't take a lot to get exposed. <laughs> well, uh, usually the evil is in my. Uh, I mean, the smile is from me, and the evil is from Divya. So she thinks she is getting an evil smile from me, but mm-hmm. usually what happens is uh, uh, the smile comes from me as the source, and uh, there is a nice tactic in uh, Hari's board. Ah, yeah, let me go there it. quickly. Nice, nice, nice. He spotted it. Knight H five check. Very, very nice tactic. Wow. And he goes rook d seven and checks twice and picks up the knight. Yeah. Yeah. If he had taken G H five, then uh, rook d seven check. No, oh, king h six. He played actually. Yeah, he played king at six because uh, this variation is just uh, two pawns down. Yep. Now I am trying to find some mating ideas, not with a lot of success though. No, I don't think you need to mate. I think you just need to take all the pawns again. Yeah, yeah. Uh, or uh, no, but seven. for example, a move like rook a seven, yeah, a move like rook a seven would be so sneaky. You can't take on h five with the king or the pawn, and you want knight f six. But it probably runs into some ninety three. Yeah, Not yeah. Sure though. Uh, I'd say good, uh, good move against with it. Did King Rukesan actually was very strong or no? Uh, Rukesan Black is defending with Rook C six. Rook C six, right? To protect uh, the F six square. Yeah, and if you continue with rook d seven, then uh, just knight into h four and uh, this g five. Square you get the g five square. Yeah. Very nice. Yeah. No, no. I mean, hurry. We don't even need to bother. I mean, he will convert. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh yeah, so clean. Rook g one, knight f four. Knight e3, knight f6. Saumi is saying, but I'm not sure which position. I guess she meant instead of knight h4. Ah, yeah, yeah, yeah. Saumi so, is very tricky, of course. Akshat, uh, he will become a GM uh, as soon as uh, he starts playing a little more tournaments. post pandemic yeah i hope so yeah now he's just as okay but still it's not easy actually shrinath right 
yeah it's not easy uh, wow he allows even mm-hmm. no it's not easy uh, because this a2 and b3 oh he's are... setting up a mating threat very sneaky very but knight f6 rook g3 no He's not playing this in the most convincing way. Oh, oh, I was I saw the moves a bit late. Yeah, yeah, king h6, yeah. Yeah, king h6, rook g4, knight e2 now. And now knight f6, rook g3. Actually, he can just take on b3 at some point. Black, huh? No, he has already put the knight on e2. Oh, okay, they are uh, playing so cool. I think so Hari is uh, safely winning here after this position. After? King c2. Mm-hmm. Uh, he just stops this f pawn with this king and no, uh, but I thought uh, at some point instead of this knight e two and all black had to try some knight b three, good or bad. But I don't. Maybe it doesn't work. Yeah, now it's. But uh, I think it's a matter of time. Yeah. Also, how quickly uh, Black King is able to reach uh, the white spawns. Mm-hmm. Well, yeah. Now, what is happening? Things are moving so quickly, yeah. Yeah, it's moving so quickly. It's like uh, commenting on this uh, games in Anish stream. <laughs> I can. But uh, it feels like uh, White has safely blockaded Black spawn. Mm-hmm. The pawn on b4 he will never push, I think. So that's the c5 square. But I don't know. Divya yeah, now saying... a5. Yes, yes. Divya is saying you have two personalities. Chat Harshit and Stream Harshit. Hmm. What is that supposed to mean? I don't know. Ah, Soumya is uh, going to sleep, yeah? Good night, Soumya. I... Uh... Thought of inviting you to the stream at some point, but yeah, I understand. So yeah, Samya really likes her sleep. She's like everyone. An example. Yeah, 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 but yeah. of course, I mean, got to do what you got to do. Yeah. Oh, now the king will go to b7 and the knight will be trapped. So game over. Yeah, or uh, just yeah, 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 yeah. For the a pawn against the knight. Yep. Yeah, everyone has uh, double personalities, but I think some people are just not restricted to two personalities. Yeah. More moves than two. Yeah. Yeah, yes, he does so this. This one so is in the bag. Yep. Wow! Look at Nakamura. Let's see. Yeah, very interesting. Yeah, 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 yeah. Wow. Oh, B B five, King B seven. It doesn't that win. Ah. Oh, he won. He won. Yeah, 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 yeah. He won. He won. People in Leeches chat are going like Hari Krishna is an end game god. I mean, they are absolutely right. I mean, Chanta is never wrong. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Chanta. <laughs> Yes, Divya is saying scooter OP, but yeah, for that I think a special stream needs to be done with Samya and. <laughs> <laughs> for that we need a special stream. I mean, we can do that tomorrow, yeah. While yeah, yeah. Uh, we entertain this, we find a way to spice up this uh, double night and. Yeah, I mean, Trotsky line. <laughs> unbelievable i would say there is no there is no end to someone's imaginations yeah <laughs> yeah 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 <laughs> okay so nakamura won actually I'm, i also need to mention that nakamura and okay probably everyone has this uh, rivalry but nakamura and aronian have have always had this sort of I mean, they always have decisive results. I think, according to my observation. Ah, okay. I uh, hadn't noticed that actually. Actually, it might have started from some World Blitz Championship in like 2014 or 13, where Aronian found a very good tactic: rook into d6 with black queen on d8 and rook on b8, and queen into d6 was met by bishop into e5, 
and ah, okay. he won up he won pawns like this so i guess it started from there but okay everyone is of course very competitive oh krishchuk versus lenier what is this uh it's a draw it is a draw yeah Akansha, don't worry. Huh? We'll uh, get to the joke sooner or later. It's not going to stay as an inside joke for uh, ever. Yeah. I guess just like every other secret, yeah? No secret is always a secret. Yeah, although I can think of one which has remained a secret all these months from uh, the chat. I don't want to get into that because... Sure. Oh, he pl- oh King G2, is he winning? King G2, King H3? Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's winning. He's winning. How did it go wrong? Uh, oh, King, King D four was mistake. Yeah, King had to do passive defense. Yeah, now F four is the move. I think he missed F four and King goes to H four. Yeah, 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 yeah. Just in yeah. time. All Ooh. these things is. Uh, Grishchuk, guys. Grishchuk is extremely good at end games, ex- uh, and also. Uh, I mean, of course, like Harik, I mean, all the players are good, but Grishchuk is an expert at tricking opponents in this end games. Yeah, yeah. Uh, I uh, remember there was a match between Alireza and Grishchuk. Yeah, uh, opposite color, Bishop, yeah? Uh, all kinds of end game, yeah. They were making draw in all, <laughs> the, all their regular blitz games. Mm-hmm. But uh, what I noticed was Alireza was overall much faster. Mm-hmm. But when it came to theoretical end games, Grishchuk could go into any position and defend like a machine. He is a beast. Yeah. And and I would like also like to mention this funny story. Uh, Grishchuk was saying that uh, Grishchuk said on stream someday that he doesn't he doesn't work on chess a lot. <laughs> and uh, then then Swidler mentioned that uh, once he played a game with Grishchuk, his whole team worked. A whole night to play against Grishuk the next day, and uh, after, uh, during the day Grishuk played some. I mean, the game was drawn, but the next day Swidler said that my team said that what you played was not right because uh, this was the refutation, and Grishuk said that no, 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 no. I have I have checked this also, but this is the problem. So, I mean, a bunch of six seven people working for yeah, Swidler were. Yeah. Uh, uh, ineffective against Grishchuk's genius. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I can totally imagine. By the way, oh, did I miss a? I guess Nepom Nashi oh, drew very quickly. We didn't have a chance to look at that, but I guess that was a pretty solid draw. Yeah. Yeah, this bishop c he played this e4 e5 bishop c4 line to avoid Petrov. Uh, I mean, in general, I guess bishop c4 is played to avoid Petrov, and also Berlin, of course. Mm-hmm. But I mean, they don't play knight f3, knight c6, bishop c4 just to exclusively avoid Petrov. I think. Right. And uh, I think a lot of Chinese players were using this. Uh, uh, until quite recently, I would say all of, but so it's very famous, of course, and yeah, but it's so they, I think they just played a s- I mean, solid Chinese draw. players were playing uh, Bishop C4 or uh, uh, Petrov. So, so the players with black were playing uh, Petrov, but the Chinese players with white were playing Bishop C4 to avoid Petrov. Okay. <laughs> oh, someone is calling. Sorry. Yeah. Uh, good try, Devya, but I think people can clearly see who the innocent person is in this group. Yeah. I mean, it is it is a bit like some game, yeah? Among us, like imposter, you know, right? Yeah, yeah, it's a very interesting game. Uh, would love to play it on uh, stream one of the days when my OBS skills get a bit upgraded. Mm-hmm. The points table... Uh, let me try to bring it on stream, although I've never uh, done this before. Yeah, so can do you do you want me to share the link of the standings? Yeah, yeah, sure. You can do that on chat. So, by the way, Harshit, do you also have a channel of your own? Uh, your streaming channel? 
I actually don't have a YouTube channel. I was streaming on Twitch before, and actually, for the for those who don't know, I I am also admitted in a university, and my classes have begun. So, uh, I ah, don't have so okay. much time to. Uh, university of Mizzou, right? Yes, I am at University of Mizzou. uh and i will be i couldn't join them this year because of covid but i'll join them in person in jan but uh, how does it work how does your classes work uh, um, it will be in us time zone right or uh... it uh, so basically they gave me special permission to have asynchronous time zone uh, asynchronous classes sorry okay uh, what is asynchronous classes? so it means that you don't have to attend it uh, live with all the other students you can attend it later okay okay okay, okay. So you can see the recorded actually on okay. follow chess there is a uh, there is a button on the right side called as standings so if you click on that link guys and click on the standings button on the right side i think you will be good to go right no harshit is not the family name my family name is raja my first name is harshit uh let me just put this on the yep stream and see how it works this window capture mm mm-hmm. uh no it's not coming mm mm-hmm. properly but i don't think anyone is anyone wants to know who the first place is because that is that is already known yeah yeah although i have to say hikaru has been given giving him a run for his money the past couple of events yeah 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 i think clear number 1 and number 2 yeah mhm but okay in, actually so wesley also did i don't think he participated in many events but he is a force to be reckoned with in in these formats yeah but i noticed that uh, wesley plays very defensively when uh, he is up against wagner Oh really? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Don't you know? I mean, there has been uh, like there was this one time when uh, Wesley made a very short draw with White against Magnus, and mm-hmm. there was an article ten uh, reasons why Wesley made a draw against <laughs> Magnus. <laughs> he was uh, coming. He was just giving uh, all kinds of excuses. Like I was feeling tired. Magnus is very strong. Yeah. I mean, but. like it it would be so difficult for these players yeah to play against magnus like it's i can feel feel for them <laughs> yeah <laughs> it's a bit like trying to bowl with a uh, inform kohli yeah wherever you bowl whatever you bowl it is going to hit the boundary <laughs> yeah these are things i just couldn't talk about yesterday you know oh yeah <laughs> Yesterday it was all about CR7. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. By the way, C- CR7 is doing pretty good. So Samya must be quite happy at, uh looking at his performance. Yeah, I I uh, don't really know what's going on in the football world. Yeah, they they even they they have actually started playing all the leagues. uh it's just that it they play indoors and no spectators are allowed okay ah so all the leagues are going on yeah and uh, the last yeah. uh, last update i have uh, cristiano was playing for real madrid wow wow guys out i mean boomer in the chat i mean <laughs> i don't even know if i was born when he was playing for cr7 it has been so long i mean <laughs> I remember uh, Cristiano played for uh, Real Madrid and Messi played for uh, Barcelona. Fortunately, Messi is still there. And then uh, Ronaldo went to uh, Manchester, or was it before that? No, no. So basically, started out at Manchester. Ah, <laughs> uh, okay. Uh, he was under uh, Sir Alex Ferguson. Uh, he was under. I mean, Alex Ferguson is for the ones who know, he's the greatest, uh, one of the greatest managers of all time. uh then he went to real madrid and finally now he is in juventus ah okay mm mm-hmm. 
people are asking if i'm in uh, jammu kashmir <laughs> Yeah. Okay, look who is here. Hello guys, hello guys. Oh, hi Anish. Hi, how nice to meet you. You are famous Mr. Harshit Raja. Nice to meet you. Oh, thanks a lot. I wanted to play bullet games. So, uh who wants to play bullet games? Yeah. Mm. Uh Anish specifically came to beat me up on bullet, but uh, But it is that first... already yesterday, yeah? Uh, yeah, 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 I can never. Have, it's never enough. It's never enough. <laughs> Nihal keeps coming, doing the same thing to me. Yeah, yeah, and then yeah. afterwards, I can't take out my frustration on his trainer. That's the cycle goes. goes on, yeah. Yes, 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 yeah. yes. So first is Nihal, <laughs> then his trainer. Yeah. But yeah, you, you. I mean, you defended your own, yeah, today in thirty seconds. Thirty uh, seconds, yeah. Surprisingly, surprisingly, uh, I can individual games. I can fight, but I guess if we play fifty game match, he will win. But in individual games, right. I can fight, of course. I can fight. Yeah. Oh, you have. No, I like your board. I like it, man. I like a lot more like this. Do, do people like it? This black and white. Yeah, yeah, like yeah. people like it. I mean, uh, I love it. Everyone love it. never likes the. Uh, you can't get everyone to like it, but I think the majority like it. So next game starts in fifteen minutes, right? Yeah, yeah. I think maybe you can start while I uh, set you up on OBS. Make myself okay. smaller and. So yeah, are sure. you gonna start with uh, with Raja or with whom? Yeah, with Harshit. Yeah. Okay, so your first name is Harshit or Raja? What is the first name? Uh, my first name is Harshit, but people in the chess community somehow know me for Raja because it's easy to pronounce. So I, yes, it's anything yeah, is fine. Uh, we have already have one Raja. We yeah, have ex- Raja. yeah, yeah, yeah. We already, so Harshit no, is I good. Harshit is better. So what's your uh, Licha's name? It's John King. I'll just I I, I can send you a ch- challenge if you want. Uh, oh, you can 30, send me challenge. I'm, I'm niche on YouTube. Thirty seconds, one minute. How? Which time control? Uh, let's do one minute now. I mean, one minute. All right. Oh, I, I I found you by the way. But okay, okay. Yeah, oh, I you have I... <laughs> you have three thousand ultra bullet games, man. Oh uh, yeah, I'm just practicing my mouse skills, looking at these young kids. Oh, you are insane, man. Okay, I'm not going to play any thirty seconds with you then. Mm-hmm. Not exactly sure why I'm entering Oops, this. I forgot to follow you guys. Guess I do this. And this. Oh, I mixed up theory. Yeah, this is the other. No, line. I think I think. No, but it's... I didn't want to play this line. I want to play the other one. <laughs> ah, okay. This one I don't know. Oh, but Nor I don't do know I. I have. Oh, but I, you don't have to. You will make me in two moves already. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God, it's so it's bad. It's line actually. This is one. Okay, you know better, but. It's line, yeah, but I don't think it should be played like this. Oh, queen e two. Okay. Can I take? Yeah, of course, it's a disastrous move. I just didn't want to, uh, you know, to lose with, with Queen's on. Oh, I this want... is bad. Sir. Okay, 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 okay. It's it's bad, sir. Yes, exactly. <laughs> yeah. Actually, I I think Long Castle is still quite good, but okay, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Long. Uh, we'll see later. Yeah. All sun. Maybe this one. Should be sir. Let's play aggressive. Oh, B C six. Oh, I thought you took D C six. It doesn't matter. It's all the same. This is bad. Okay, let's do this. Oh, 
Oh, boom. Okay. Slow, 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 slow. Bad game, bad game. Yeah. Do you have headphones? Because I can hear your uh, tac tac and my tac tac, you know, it's... it's oh, sorry, sorry. I'll, I'll... No, no problem. But like I have like double, you know, like tic tac and then also on your end. Sorry, sorry. I'll keep problem, it problem. close. Ah, it's one one, yeah? And, uh, okay, I, yeah, I can no, he destroyed play, me. Uh, yeah, I can, I of can course. You can, you can start. I first want to, I want to, uh, I want to play a couple, couple good games with John King. And then sure, I will... Sure. Uh... Okay. Oh, sorry. Oh, yeah, nice, nice. No, I played very badly from opening. I got lucky there. I was tilted. I got lucky there. Bar, you want a bar? Okay, fine. I just muted myself so these guys yes, can't join really me. Well played. Yes. A pretty intense match, yeah. It's actually pretty even. I don't know if I can uh, 
enable the bar here while I'm observing like this. I don't know where the bar is. Yeah, that's my uh, student's pa uh, favorite uh, activity. But it's also something I enjoy quite a bit. But uh, but yeah, now I'm free to look at the position. So what's going on? In bullet, it just moves so fast, you know, you're commenting about one portion and suddenly there is just a new portion on the board. Yeah, the main game started, but I think we can uh, go there a bit later, yeah? While, uh, why did, uh, why did Harshit blender this? Oh, he just, he just missed this completely. That's, uh, okay. But still this knight has no square to go. C5 and A5 is covered, so... Not such an expensive blender, but uh, looks like uh, he just takes with the queen. Takes, yeah, very good endgame. Takes back. That is huge blender. Yeah. Clearly missed rook d6. Actually, okay. you could just take on d1, yeah? It was not so clear. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Also, I missed queen f5, d5 at some point. Yeah, yeah, you had. Well, I had still there some ninety seven later, but but yeah, it was better, of course. Very interesting games. Srinath, this is the that's a top a top level commentary. Yeah? <laughs> every every three games, that's very interesting games. <laughs> Everything, and he thinks this is uh, you know top level commentary there. Competition for Sagar Shah there, guys. Um. <laughs> no, I was muting myself. You know, it's not. On purpose or? Yeah, 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 I had muted myself on Zoom. Ah, like so that. Okay. Gameplay. But you thought, okay, this is anyway, the level so low, it cannot be worse, yeah? So let's just unmute. <laughs> uh, no, I didn't see that the new game had started. <laughs> also, I thought Harshit uh, needed some help distracting you to reverse the momentum. No, I think uh, he is not. Ah, the momentum, yeah, that's true. Yeah, so back to muting myself. Yeah, back to muting myself while uh, I set up the OBS for the live. Uh, you guys can uh, enjoy this. What okay, did after the queen, 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 queen blunder? Yeah, momentum is uh, huge, of course, here. In these games. Yeah, bullet yeah. is a lot about momentums. Okay. okay, now I think these uh, this will keep following uh, while I go instead of the obvious. I could probably uh, have a more elegant structure. But, uh, Oh, Ooh. I wanted to play Kimi, but it's also okay. This is also cool. Even better maybe than what I wanted. No. Not sure. Not really better. <laughs> 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 yeah. Oh, you run. Well, I'm trying. <laughs> it's not like... I'm trying. It's not called run. It's called trying to run. Oh, alt, please tell me, please. Uh, yeah. <laughs> please, guys. Uh, <laughs> okay, let's listen. Oh, no, no, no. Okay. I was hoping you wouldn't <laughs> that know. That is sad. That is sad. I saw, of course, the move. Oh, my God. I'm... It's 
sad, but I was not allowed to help. Done after this. Oh yeah, that's speed, man. Oh, those so close, so close. But what is uh, what is it? Alt, yeah. It's uh, I I don't know honestly. I, it, they usually say alt. Oh my oh, god. I'll have a heart attack after such games. I have. Yeah, I think it's alt on leeches and control on. Uh, but uh, com or something. Oh, I had rook d6. Oh my god. When? Instead, of, okay, but you take on e7, so it still goes on. Instead of EF, yeah, EF at night, of course, but yeah. Yeah, uh, no, my whole point was, of course, that you will uh, spend all the time trying to put a knight. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. But uh, yeah, that was no, sneaky. It was, uh, the game was, uh, yeah, it was a nice game, nice game. In general, it's good. You know, today I invited a um, international master from India, and yeah. uh, I made good choice because if I had invited you, you would for sure lose. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that was good. No, but I think you're also lucky that uh, Sankut needed a bit of time to warm up. He, I, I told you about him, yeah, on the WhatsApp chat. Uh, sometimes he yeah, plays yeah. really well and... Yeah, yeah, no, today he clearly had an off day, um, yeah. but it was hard. It was hard, it's hard sometimes, yeah. Actually, this night... Oh, you started playing? Sorry. No, no. Who? Who I thought playing? you and Srinath were playing. No. We can play one game, Srinath, and then the, you can continue the show. Sure. Just a moment. By the way, Anil, I wanted to know your opinion about this C6, which Carlson player has never really looked at this. C6, uh, sorry, which opening? Oh, the oh, one which she played F3. with Firo. Yeah. 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 Um, I, I think it's supposed to be dubious, but I think it's some. Isn't it some E4 D takes E4 Queen C2 something like this? It's not after C6, though, is it? Where is this e4 d4 queen c2? It's not here. Yeah, yeah, I see. Yeah, yeah, I understood. Yeah. So. Let, me, let me check. Let me check. No, it was c6 was not good. Uh, let me check why. <coughs> I mean, I thought it was not good. Yeah. But he, so... of course, just wanted to take him out of book. Yeah. Yeah. True. Ah, okay. Let me see the. Uh, let me see what the computer is saying. If it was not c6 uh, e4. One sec. Oh, it seems really also straight. Oh, at this time. Yeah. Wow. No, but you know, we did he had some kind of thing that he was streaming something and then um, suddenly his chat started to bully him. It was very weird. Yeah, mm -hmm. but maybe not all the chat. Yeah, I mean, but uh... yeah, yeah, yeah. No, so, so it's true. It's true. It's true. So the point is after C6. Yeah, I think the line that I talk about is E4, D4, F4. And yeah, yeah. it is, uh, it's actually not so bad for black. Yeah, maybe. Mm -hmm. Wow. Maybe, yeah. But, uh, okay, but Black uh, can have many lines, yeah? All kinds of options are there. Somehow thought that after you take on C3, C5 has to be the way to go, but yeah, this was new. Well, C6, it was played by, I think, uh, Tivikov plays only the system. Mm -hmm. uh, Sergei Tivikov, the Dutch, uh, Russian Dutch Grandmaster. Yeah. Okay, let's follow the games, not the start, I think. Yeah, I, I have it on the right already. Uh, Hikaru. Okay, nice. Harikush. So while you guys are playing, I uh, managed to create a new scene on my OBS. Wow. Wow. Impressive, yeah? Yeah, just We sense. are supposed to be greatly impressed. By the way, this uh, game... Uh... Because of the standards set by AD, uh, I think we all look impressive. Yeah, the competition is not very, uh, <laughs> very hard. Yeah. Oh, this uh, might have... This Carlson versus Young is very interesting, which Anish must be knowing. Oh, Vidit simply continues. Very cool. Very cool. Do you uh, do you use Apple devices yourself, Anish? Uh, Apple devices? Yeah, yeah. That was the. Team yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm a big fan. Big fan. Ah, okay. Mm. Let me write um, uh, write to Vidit.
I'll just uh, get some water. Yeah, yeah, sure. So, uh, what were you guys talking about? The chess part? Uh. Well, that, we didn't look at the games just yet. Let's see. So, which game are we following now? Uh, I have... Uh, okay, Hikaru Hare Krishna is one game. It continues with this uh, H4 Karakan. Yeah, there is a bunch of games in this tournament with Karakan H, um, E5, H5, H4, 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 H3, yeah? Yeah, I can uh, already uh, remember two, yeah. One was this Hikaru Ali Reza, where uh, mm -hmm. Ali Reza went Queen A6 without E6 and Hikaru got E6 himself. Correct. Correct. And, uh, I think then he corrected. No, no, but but sorry, but sorry, 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 sorry. That was Bishop D2, not Knight D2. Ah, okay, okay. Bishop mm -hmm. D2, Queen A6, E6. So Hikaru deviator, yeah. He went uh, Knight D2 against Hikaru. Knight D2, yeah. Yeah, E6. Right. And also there were games without H4, H5, just Bishop D3. That's also a thing. Bishop E2, yeah. Knight Bishop D3, D3 without H4, H5. I mean. Ah, uh, okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. Was also yeah. played. Yeah, these are very double-edged positions. I mean, very often uh, black takes over the initiative here, very often, but sometimes not. Right. Because he has, a, he has a potentially a better bishop, yeah? Potentially. Uh, so there is some strategic risk for white because black has potentially a good bishop and white has potentially weak e5 pawn. But white is a little bit up in development, I feel, but here. potentially so... weak e5 pawn, it's already taken, no? <laughs> I mean, at the start of it, but yeah, <laughs> it's already taken. Yes. But it's nice. And when they take your weakness, you don't have it anymore. So it's also nice. Yeah. Yeah, this queen a5, queen a6, I, I saw in a book of Nimzovich, yeah? He he won some nice games there, right? Which one? Uh, in this queen a5, queen a6 idea. Who ah, I... Nimzovich already. Wow, I didn't know that. Uh, I think so. Yeah. And then there, I mean, there were three games, yeah, with one was with amateur, one was with uh, some strong player, and one was with grandmaster, something like this. And he won both the games with black, wow. but all the games. Harshit knows uh, so much of history, yeah? Nimsovich, yeah, you're saying, Nimsovich, yeah? Mm -hmm. Or am I wrong? Maybe wrong. No, because I uh, I was always told that Nimsovich is, okay, I read this, all this uh, stuff, but I was told, as a kid, yeah, I read this, but I uh, don't remember anything. I was just told that uh, it's nonsense, all what he says. But uh, <laughs> and also there are people who say that he was like um, a level of twenty maximum twenty three hundred, twenty three hundred maximum, which is could possibly uh, true. I mean, if you look from now. I mean, yeah, but, I yeah, but then everything changes. Yeah, uh, no, this, it's is time. Were, uh, this is what uh, you were told in Netherlands that uh, Nimzo, which was uh... <laughs> no, because in uh, India, uh, in India, like everyone is like my system is the greatest. Sis, really? Yeah. In the world. Yeah, 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 yeah. Really? Wow. But yeah. I I heard this in some other stream as well that everyone says my system is the best book of all time, but no one really reads it all that well. Yeah, everyone talks about it, and you sort of agree. No, actually, I uh, I actually uh, did read it as a kid, I think, and I remember a few things from that. But I think it's mostly like you know it was an important point in the development of chess history. Uh, but I guess that now, let's say, looking back, you know, uh, it's advanced so much, so far, that some of what he says is already there. And it's probably relevant only for beginners because um, uh, modern international masters, modern grandmasters are uh, already ahead because they are, you know, they're standing on his knowledge, you know, yeah, they're basing yeah. there. Right. So I, I guess it, uh, probably it was very important what he has done uh, in his, uh, you know, at, at those times. But right. uh, I guess modern kids, um, they, you know, I don't know if, uh, let's say, Okay, it's nice to read the book, maybe why not? But probably there are also better ways to, to improve yeah. the chat. Okay. Yeah, for example, a line which you and Magnus were repeating in uh, like in this, uh, what? Bishop B4 variation, what is it? Dragosin, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. That too, I mean, that basically defies all of the uh, previous rules. Yeah, that is why it sort of completely ignores its development, but still tries to play this. You mean with bishop f4, yeah, that one, or? Yeah, bishop f4. Mm -hmm. 
Mm-hmm. Yeah, no, these rules are, uh, of course. No, but I'm just curious, uh, uh, Anish, uh, do you know this guy? Uh, do you know this international master, Willy Hendricks? I mean, of course. I yeah, yeah, of course, of course, of course. He's Dutch now. Mm-hmm. Yeah, so I'm, I'm a big fan of his work and his mm-hmm. ideas and thoughts in general. Uh, what do you think? Yeah, he made, the, he wrote this hilarious book, uh, hilarious title called uh, Move First, Think Later. Move First, Think Later, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. 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 Oh, yeah. To be very honest, be very honest, I actually haven't read the full book. Uh, I I know what it's about and I spoke, I, um, I was told what it's about, mm-hmm. uh, but I haven't read it myself. Uh, but from what I heard, it sounded very, very interesting. And a few of the ideas, because I think my Erwin read it and he told me a lot of things from there. And from what I uh, heard, yeah, he has these uh, ideas, for example, uh, uh, that things are a lot more random than they uh, that that they appear, yeah. And let's, let's say uh, even when somebody wins a tournament, you know, it's not it's not that he was winning. Like let's say when you won uh, as India, you won the gold medal, yeah. Mm-hmm. You're going to this press conference afterwards, and then you say, yeah, of course you won because you know Vishnath is a great captain. You know he was fixing all the internet, and then we had you know Vishyanand who is a legend, and we also had Vidit who is simply a master blaster captain, everything. We had these talented youngsters, you know, and they, uh, but of course you understand, let's say if, if let's say somewhere here or there uh, in some match with, uh, I don't know, uh, Poland or something that some move would be uh, made different, you know, uh, you would yeah, be knocked yeah. out on semi-final, yeah. there would be no such talk, you know, yeah. you are not anymore wise, you are just wise captain. Yes. The wisdom is gone from your head. Yes. The Vishyanand uh, from legendary becomes uh, already legendary, no, but more legend. of... The uh, only thing that remains is that Vishyanan remains legendary, but already <laughs> yeah. uh, everything else changes, you know? Yeah, uh, yeah. You know, Divya needs more experience, and Nihal is also too, uh, you know, not handling his time well, uh, and all everything comes uh, against you again. Yeah. So, um, and these kind, these kind of thoughts I really like, because I think uh, we do so much based on hindsight. Also, when we analyze our games, and we, uh, I think we draw so many wrong conclusions, because, you know, as we try to learn from our mistakes, and I also myself constantly do that. I mean, very often you you think you try to improve and you think that, okay, I will, you know, I've, maybe you think that, let's say, you blame uh, some opening for that. Or you think maybe that you uh, prepare too much or maybe you think you prepare too little. Like you try to make always a conclusion, right? Why yeah. something went wrong. Yeah, but yeah, I, yeah. I feel very often uh, what people do is sometimes um, they are changing something which was not the, the reason for the failure. Sometimes I believe in the rare cases, a failure could also be caused just by, uh, uh, by first of all, uh, you have wrong expectation. Maybe failure was normal result for you at the time. Mm-hmm. Secondly, maybe uh, it was bad. It was maybe bad luck. Can happen, yeah. Once that it's bad luck. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. And uh, uh, maybe sometimes, sometimes maybe better not to draw conclusion from your loss, yeah, than to do it, uh, than to draw wrong one, let's say. Yeah. So I think this is a very important question. And I also try, I think every all professional chess players, they are trying um, to improve always. And they are trying to analyze their games. And they have to do it. And they do it. And it's important. And they always try to improve, yeah? To do something better than you did before. Yeah. Um, but it's very, very difficult. Because I think sometimes, uh, sometimes, yes, you have to really try to understand, was that the reason, you know, that you you won? Like, let's say, uh, imagine, the, let's say you won a tournament. And um, in that tournament, you prepared this five hours a day and had no rest at all. And you just only prepared and things came on the board and you won. And you think next time, okay, this is my perfect routine. But okay, maybe you just got lucky that tournament. Maybe actually you should have rested. It's yeah. too much prep. You just, you got lucky. But you will always think that, no, no, no. This was good, you know? Uh, so sometimes it's difficult yeah. to uh, draw right conclusions in chess, especially. Because, you know, especially in chess, unlike, let's say, running. When you are running uh, 100 meters, you both are running and we measure the time, right? Uh, yeah. You can you measure, let's say, you run 100 meters in 9.81 seconds, and that's your time, right? That's your result. In chess, your result depends on your opponent also. It's the game with opponent. So if opponent plays well, bad luck. If opponent plays um, badly, it's good for you. So uh, it's much harder to draw conclusion on your result because your result is actually in itself subjective because it's based on your opponent, not only on you. But isn't that so in running as well? Just curious. Uh, I don't think that, no, but in running, do you just run on your own uh, line, right? Ah, like that. Ah, yeah, understood. Yeah. Right. No, but I, I mean to say, like, let's say, okay, of course, if you run 9.81 and opponent mm-hmm. 979, he wins. But I mean that you can always measure your own time. You can see your own your own time, mm-hmm. right? In chess, yeah, you yeah. don't see your own time. You see only your score compared to your opponent. So maybe you know you played maybe well for your standards, but maybe your opponents played just much better than they would usually would. So you had bad luck. It's also possible, no? 
I so in just, general uh, you like it, i guess this is true yeah that after a point psychology just plays a much important role than than skill like n- not exactly but in a way yeah um well it can it can for sure especially in a negative way i think psychology can influence you mostly negatively than positively like uh, you can uh, you can start playing badly because of psychology uh, like i was I, like i started after the queen exactly exactly, exactly exactly <laughs> and uh, I think the psych- I think that I like it's already enough if psychology uh, lets you to play how you can play you know if you can perform mm-hmm. at your own level that's already great I mean that psychology sometimes you know for example Fabiano was on seven out of seven remember one tournament yeah, yes 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 and their psychology was huge plus for him yeah it's very rare like at some point he was he was inspired and you know he felt wonderful and uh, it works in plus but usually psychology is uh, like uh i am already happy when psychology doesn't bother me you know when it's just um and i think many top players are like this that they yeah it can definitely bother and um, it can affect you negatively and then the problem is that you start performing worse than you can that's the most annoying part right it's yeah. not that you perform uh uh just not well enough but it's that you perform worse than you yourself know you can play let's say we played now a few games last ones you know that okay you maybe you would lose to me anyway if we play long many games but okay you know that you will play better than this right so yeah. um, that's that's uh, annoying thing also it I, i okay maybe we can start looking at the games well okay if you have more questions yeah. i think i mean because the uh, people watching they love to hear anish wisdom so uh, like in... yeah, usually i usually i speak about dicaprio and other actors but uh, <laughs> yeah, yeah that was we speak about chess it's okay we can speak about oh my god lenier dominguez against yan nepomnes is epic just yeah yeah, 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 yeah i was yeah. looking yeah yeah, yeah. I want to see no Pomeshi's reaction more than anything else. Well, I think he should resign here. Yeah, I mean, even even for Nepo, this is. No, but he just blundered Queen D five now. Yeah, yeah, no, yeah. He pl- he blitzed out everything till then, so it was I don't know. Yeah, Queen what? But even before Queen D5, ever like in engineer showing like plus three point five, so that is already some. Yeah. Oh, it was already winning basically the whole thing. Yeah. This move. Uh, wait, what did he do wrong exactly? Let's see. Yeah, Bishop E7 is, is a mistake. It seems. Wow, but it's so hard to not play Bishop E7. How do you want to play? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, it yeah. was just a very dirty prep, uh, very very dirty prep, mm-hmm. very dangerous prep. But this line is quite dubious. Yeah, I mean, uh, in general, yeah, this line where you play Karokan, we mm-hmm. play c6, and on move three already you play c5. It's I know this line is not bad at all. I know it. it's kind this of this knight d3. Point. I thought in general, I thought c4 knight e7, or is it the same? If knight c3, what, what would be the difference? Ah, it's yeah, it's the same. Yeah, sorry. Then you have to no, but actually, I think I recognize this line. I think I even seen it. Mm-hmm. But uh, of course, this the fact that you play c65. I know that Nihal actually plays it a lot, but this line, of course, it's very risky because uh, yeah, yeah, you yeah. spent you know one extra move with the pawn. So mm-hmm. it's easy. I think let's say one more mistake and it can be uh, very bad. That's the problem. Yep. Uh, are you super... talking about this uh, three c5 gender? Yeah, I think also, so. No? So Lila does not like it so much for black. No, I, I think it, I think it's okay. No, but I think uh, engine say it's uh, engine actually quite like it the c5, and I think it's a fine line in general. But it's like it's a little bit um, fundamentally a little bit unhealthy, no? So then you the price for move becomes very high. Yeah, I mean it all, it all depends on uh, if your opponent knows it well or not. Yeah, and I think uh, at a lower level, uh, probably it works better. Well, on high level, it's also okay. I mean, never plays it successfully. But let's say when uh, not, opponent not expects so it, longer time controls or is it? Uh, I don't know, but let's say when opponent expected, like Lenier clearly prepared. When he prepared, targeted for it, and it's kind of dangerous, of course, yeah. Lenier is an extremely dangerous preparation, right? He also. Very, yeah. I very. was discussing just before you joined that uh, this Karwana played G4 today. If I don't know if you saw fifth move in Perk, and I think it was developed or played by uh, Dominguez first. in e4 d6 oh you speak of the other tournament the bundesliga oh yeah bundesliga sorry yeah uh, let me should have me mentioned see. that no because i was briefly confused as i was looking for fabiano in the tournament and i'm like wait but he doesn't play bundesliga <laughs> <laughs> with gulu yeah. simon i think uh, ah yeah 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 this much for you 
Polish junior. Yes. Oh, he destroyed this Pirk in no time, yeah? Yeah, actually this G4, I th- yeah, it's very strong move. I mean, it, mm. it, it mm-hmm. lists in if you don't know. Yeah, yeah, I think, but even if you know, in general, this Pirk is simply just seems to be just a very dangerous, very, very, very dubious opening, yeah, in general. Mm-hmm. But actually, I was always playing this knight f3, knight c3, bishop e2, bishop e3, that I have small advantage, but somehow I was not getting anywhere. But so, yeah, I think some, uh, there's something like g4 aggressive makes sense. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. bishop e3 setup, yeah. Yeah, he just absolutely crushed. By the way, Anish, did you see e5 of Rappo? Uh, oh yeah, it, even the engine that was broadcasting. Yeah, I did not understand. Oh, wow. Hilarious. No, but the guy he sometimes plays out of so the world. beautiful man. Out also, of. you know his preparation. Like you think that you think well, if you see his games, he plays nonsense. Yeah, just nonsense. You think? Actually, I've played with him two times. Yeah, like both uh-huh. the times. Yeah, I mean, he, he, I guess he's he just plays some setups which he likes. Like Stonewall, he, he plays. Yeah, but he studies them really well. He really mm. studies this stuff. Like, for example, also there, it's not as stupid as it looks. His usual, his idea is to play a line that looks completely stupid, but it's actually not so stupid. And he actually spends a lot of time in it, I'm sure. Because uh, wherever I see his games, even when he plays system that you think is nonsense, it's always really not so bad. With both but colors. maybe he has more experience. Maybe also experience he has, yeah? Uh, yeah, I think he just works on this stuff, on the systems, and he's simply a very good player. He's just a good player. Actually. Yeah, yeah, that is true. Uh, you know what is also uh, very interesting is that Strinath is behind our back. He's uh, chatting in his own chat. <laughs> 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 no, it's such impolite behavior. Strinath is a bit like um, to invite your guests to home, oh and then uh, you say, and then you, you know, instead of hosting them and offering them tea, you go and you start <laughs> looking in your phone. You know? <laughs> <laughs> oh my god this is especially on your own stream such behavior is a uh, very strange very strange okay but i'm not ignoring you guys yeah i'm, not, I'm, uh, really, I'm making all these expressions i'm looking like i'm yeah. listening and yeah yeah but uh also making uh, <laughs> also making sounds like mm, and, uh, <laughs> I, mean, I don't think anish is indian enough to get used to those sounds no, but with uh, Europeans, you say. You know that, uh, Harsh, you know the, my Indianity, yeah? The Indi- Indian mirror of mm-hmm. myself. So I used to be a quarter Indian, yeah? Because my grandmother is from India. Oh. Yeah, yeah I used to be quarter. I, I used to be, but uh, listen, important. So my, my father is from uh, half, he's basically Nepal. He's from Nepal. Uh, but his mother is, though, uh, his mother is Indian. So he's technically half uh, half Indian, yeah? He, his uh, father is, an, is Nepali. So, so that is actually more than 25%, no, 33%. Not 25, because only grandmother no. is Indian. Then grand... Okay, okay, sorry. Okay, but let's say a bit... Well, basically the joke... Well, basically my father's father is from Nepal, so mm-hmm. it's not that far off, yeah? Uh, so the thing is, before Olympiad, I was quarter Indian, but after <laughs> India won Olympic gold, I promoted to half Indian. Now I'm half Indian. Oh, wow. Yeah. It's, uh, they promoted me. Because now it's okay, so now I'm half Indian. Now that India is Olympic champion, I want to be part of it, so... Great. But uh, yeah. Uh, Anisha, do you also have a website of your own? Website? Yeah, because I saw some uh, website, uh, anishgiri.nl, and uh, it was like. Uh, yeah, yeah, well, it's the actually. Text was in Hindi. Uh, there were, no, no, there were, there were like a bunch of languages. There is the, the thing yeah, is, yeah, I used yeah. to have a website. It's still, yeah. it's still live. Uh, it's in all kinds of languages. Uh, even languages I don't know, like Spanish <laughs> and stuff. Yeah. But, um, uh, but the thing is, um, uh, basically, I want a new one. I want a new one. So I'm, I'm, I'll very soon uh, get a new website because it's a bit outdated. It's bad on the phone. It's some old technology. It's a bit right, dated right. and uh, it's updated. I will get a new website. In general, websites nowadays are quite, uh, uh, you know, they're, they're just like, uh, uh, I'd say, just introduction to yourself. Yeah, it's not really uh, anymore like yeah, it's uh, not the content or anything. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's much more. So it's, it's going to be different. But, but yeah. Um, yeah, Nepo resigned after that. Yeah, that was too much even for Nepo, yeah. And what's going on in this uh, Magnus Jeffrey? Uh, oh. So first first question, uh, where, where did it deviate from your uh, chess table course? Yeah. Oh, uh, cute, 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 cute. Mm-hmm. Uh, well, it deviated from my chess table course, I think after Knight of 3. Um, I, well, Bishop D7 is not my main recommendation, but actually it's okay. The second time it deviated is on move 9. I go Knight BC6, he went C4. Ah, okay. I don't 
uh, have this. Uh, okay, maybe I mentioned this an option. I don't remember. Maybe I mentioned this option option, but I don't think I take the pawn on a4. Uh, oh, he also he blundered also on c2 by the way, Magnus. Yeah, yeah. Um, he blundered on c2, but I think his uh, his portion is okay. Yeah, the present portion. Well, uh, <laughs> I was about to say that it goes to show me now. Yeah, I can blunder two pawns and still be yeah. here. <laughs> but okay, it's bad advertisement for my course. <laughs> Uh, but uh, no, but it's, uh, I think it's, I don't know, I think it's still, uh, I would still prefer black, to be honest. Hmm. I mean, I have this pawn on c2, if you take on c2, then... Uh, yeah, I don't, I mean, takes, then you just play queen d3 and you are safe. Yeah, yeah, I... Queen e4 enter. next. Yeah, I kind of, uh, if you take on c6, knight c6, rook 6, I give some kind of check on b1 or rook c8, yeah, I don't know. Oh yeah, yeah probably... rook into c6, yeah, I actually underestimated. Rook c6 is there, yeah. It's uh, ah, but okay, bishop c2 D1, maybe. Yeah. Oh, queen D1, yeah. Let's see if he does bishop c2 because it's a four sequence. I don't know if he wants it. He might want But actually, bishop else. c2, okay. So, bishop h7 is a threat. Okay. Yeah, it is a force line. Yeah, bishop c2, black has to take, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And queen d3 and uh, Take on c6. Now does white have anything better than c6? Well, you can play some intermezzo, but like rook c3. Yeah, I and how is this question anyway after rook c6 matches with rook c6? Guys, by the way, just a little intermezzo. Uh, Harry is a pawn up in an endgame. Okay. So Sagar would be very happy here, very excited. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, wow, uh, I think it will take me a really, really long time to learn uh, Saga's levels of excitement and uh, animation. Uh, I think you'll never reach it, uh, Sunat. Let's see. <laughs> to be honest. True, 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 true. I think you'll never reach it. I think uh, the moment you reach his level of excitement, you need to go to the doctor. Something is off with you. <laughs> yeah. I don't think they have invented such drugs that can get you to the <laughs> level of excitement of Sagar. I don't think that's... The, the, the... <laughs> not yet, not yet. Oh. But uh, Harry actually tremendous, yeah. I guess Nakamura, one of the strongest wow, rapid yeah, players, yeah. Uh, blitz players, and stuff. Uh, uh, did you, did so. you say Harry's uh, first game? Uh, <laughs> With Harry's right? Jeffrey. Yeah, I, I saw all the games, but let me see. Like Queen G three move. Yeah. Thirteenth or fourteenth move, Queen G three. But you know why he played it? Hare Krishna is an endgame master. He wants to play queen g3, then knight to h3, then queen to g5, then trade the queens. <laughs> he did that. He did that. <laughs> no, this is actually going to come on uh, Chessbiz India stream tomorrow. Yeah? Yeah, I mean, yeah. Not the stream, but the video. Hare yeah, Krishna yeah. beats yeah. Jeffrey. But seriously, uh, do you th uh, really think he intended this queen g5 and this whole thing when he played queen g3? It looked completely strange to me. Uh, let me tell you the point. I, I can't think like Harry. Uh, let me think what he would want. So look, look what Harry thought. I'll explain. Mm -hmm. Harry Krishna thought. Uh, I want to play after c5, the move e5. And after c4, I want to have e takes d6. I think the point is that if let's say you play a rook, uh, let's say rook g1 or something, yeah? Yeah. Uh, you go on c5, you go e5, he goes c4. Ah, okay. The queen g3 was prophylaxis against c5, he does c5, he go e5. Okay, okay, okay. That was the point. C5 and e5, okay. Nice. And that's also what he did, but uh, it was just not very good. But he did beat him in the end. Yeah, yeah, yeah true. No, but okay. Uh, Neither on G4, yeah, probably is the way, yeah. G4 is normal move, yeah. Yeah, G4 is normal move. G4 is normal move, or I think uh, also uh, just some normal developing move. Rook E1, something like this. Yeah, Rook E1 actually is a uh, standard type of move, yeah. But yeah, wow. Queen G3 is very weird, yeah. I didn't pay attention. But G4, what if Black does the same? He can still do it, yeah. No, but actually, Harry, he. Uh, Sometimes in the positions that are full with tension, he doesn't choose the best. Uh, like he likes uh, clarified positions, you know. Right. 
and here it's like it's very tense yeah like there's a hedgehog and like mm -hmm. like maybe goes c5 maybe not go c5 maybe he goes g4 maybe he doesn't go g4 like it's a little bit like um i think he is trying to he is trying to achieve some kind of clarity uh and then he's quite happy i would guess okay. so interesting i'm learning about the players from my own team on my streams yeah but also Anish and some Shenzhen masters went into an end game with him, right? In this Bishop H5 night. Yeah, but a very, very nice game. game. Very nice. But okay. Uh, yeah, it was that actually, actually just, that game one of my best games. Revolution, revolutionary, I think, because th before that everyone thought uh, this D5 is really nice and. Well, actually, uh, actually not exactly. The thing is that it was uh, already played before in some rapid tournaments. This ah. idea, I played myself, but it was uh, the first time it got uh, very big. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. That's true. That's true. But uh, it was kind of nice. It was a simple game, but actually, all game I think was first line of engine that I played all really the game. I mean, yeah, I studied that. Very nice game. Yeah, but it was you just a surprising. In the opening, right? Uh, you, I think. Uh, yeah, yeah. I got yeah. into a very, very good end game, and it was very easy to play. That's why I played like uh, engine the whole game. It was very easy position to play. Yeah, now the in yeah. engine gives some crazy peace sacrifice lines, which is still very complicated. Uh, for who? For black, yeah. After G four. No, after H3 bishop, H, something like that. H3 bishop H3. Are you bishop, about H3. the Magnus game? No, no. Uh, this uh, this line of Hari versus uh, sorry Anish versus Hari. Ah, okay, ah, okay, yeah, okay, yeah, okay, yeah, yeah. okay. No, that's that's uh, that's still unclear. That's a different story, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. By the way, now uh, Jeffrey Jean is doing well, yeah. Ah, okay. But uh, do you think Hari is clearly winning? He's just a pawn. Uh, Serena, I'm a bit concerned about uh, Indian youth. Uh, they really have some sleeping uh, issues, yeah? Yeah, and, and then they blame me. Uh, uh, yeah, it's uh, some disciplinary talk that I think has to has to happen uh, there, Serena, well, with, uh, with as, me, as, it as the wise captain. What work, do you think? But maybe you can try your luck. You know, they say, they say that you should uh, lead by example, yeah? <laughs> yeah, true, true. Uh, but okay, no, uh, thousand people will be disappointed if you stop the stream, so don't lead by example. <laughs> it's it's tough, yeah? On the one hand is love for chess, on the other hand is asleep. Uh, is that Actually, I have an excuse in the form of, my, like, my online classes are around this time for university, so I have to stay up late. You are actually studying in university at this, uh, the same time, yeah? Yeah, I, I just recently joined this uh, University of Miso. Uh, in US with Opera. Wait a second. You are now in States. Actually I'm not because I couldn't go there. Uh you're supposed to go to States. Mm -hmm. Oh you're receiving online classes. That's why the yeah. timing is. Yeah, yeah. Oh, and you are based in which city now? I I'm actually in Pune. Oh, Pune is a famous <laughs> city. That, that Pune is a famous city. Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so Mia. And uh, also there is Abhimanyu Puranik in our cities. So Pune has a lot of players. Uh huh. Uh -huh. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. A lot of players. Yeah. Yeah, it's a nice city. Um, you know, if you have <laughs> internet problems but you want to stay near Nashik, then Pune is a good place. <laughs> Guys, uh, by the way, what is uh, somebody said when somebody says uh, for CBI? Because I always think chess based India, but it's something else, right? No, it's chess based India, I guess. No, but they say like Anish is destroying our sleeping schedule. CBI for Anish. Is it ah, CBI uh, Investig Central Bureau of Investigation. It it's stands like, for. Uh, it's like FBI, but it's not. It's FBI of it's FBI of India. Yeah, um, but it's not. Because I thought chess based India for Anish. Like, it's strange. Even I did, yeah. But now that you mentioned, okay. I, yeah. Actually, there's a lot of drama going on in in India about some CBI, some CBI cases. So I guess it, the chat is quite hyped up because of that. Ah, okay, okay. Wow, guys, very exciting games. I scrolled, so Grishuk did some kind of peace sacrifice. Yeah, yeah. Uh, I have it on the right corner. And uh, uh, on the main board, I have this uh, Hikaru Hare Krishna. So I think we should talk about uh, how far he's winning. So the Indian, uh, uh, yeah, <laughs> no, but it's not easy at all. <laughs> it's not easy at all. Uh, Yeah, I have a feeling uh, the more unstructured the stream goes, uh, the more viewers it has. Yeah, because you talk about everything, yeah? 
so everyone can relate to it uh that's true that's true that's true yeah. uh so black will somehow try to push the deep on yeah the only way yeah but h5 pawn is half lost yeah it's uh, but i don't know if he's taking it. f2 is also hanging yeah it's it's very hard uh, i think but i, I guess think, yes yes uh, I, maybe there is like a white has hope because if he trades everything he just even pawn down he might just hold it yeah not enough material maybe like all the pieces no, let's say no, not all. I mean, let's say knight f3, a check, and then let's say uh, king c5 or something, or what? Sure. Uh, or knight if where do you play knight f3 check? Uh, yeah, king c5 because king e4, knight g5 might be a problem. Yeah, let's say knight d3 check, and just actually just knight d4 maybe. Ah, you want to sit like this? But I have knight c5 there, right? Trying to exchange a knight. Yes, and then ninety five, king c six. Yeah, it's hard to say. So let's say, let's say, uh, what I wanted to to say, I don't know how, but let's say I play knight h five, I move forty three. Sure. Knight f two and knight f four back. Like I want to change also g and f somehow, but it's gonna be hard. Yeah. And if I go ninety four there. Yeah, it's pretty nasty. I thought maybe knight d three and g four, but I don't know. It's uh, pretty unpleasant. So in general, does black want to trade a knight? Yeah, I think so. He he wants to he wants to keep, of course, one queen side, one king side pawn. Yeah, as well. He wants to keep as many pawns as possible and trade the knight for clarity. Right. But I think White would like want. I don't know if it's possible, but White would like to trade all the king side pawns and then just have one against two. That's what I was trying to. Mm -hmm. But if but the pawn is on g3, then ah, oh, it's yes. a draw. Well, yeah, according to what Samir taught her, taught us. it's <laughs> 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 Yeah. Oh my god, you know what's amazing? Oh, Sonia told us, yes. You know what's amazing? Yes. Uh, oh, that's actually completely insane. Uh, that Levon manages to lose because his knight is... Uh, his knight is kind of... It's kind of, I don't know, it's dominated. Oh my god, only two moves. Ah, it's like uh, one of your games against uh, Nihal, yeah? Today, in today's stream? Not mine, it was actually Max Marmardam who beat him. Really? Uh, with that knight getting trapped? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. No, it was Max. Ah, okay. He's actually lost. It's unbelievable. If he had knight on e6, look, he of course could never imagine he would lose, yeah? He was playing for a win, of course. But He's wait, is this so lost? Like if I go f6, king g6, and if I try to hold? Uh, so f6, king f4, king g6, I go bishop d6, it's a tuxong, yeah? It's, a, it's completely lost, I think. It's just tuxong, I guess. Yeah, it's so... Okay, can I go king g7? Okay, you have so many extra moves as well, yeah, that's... Um, no, but I, yeah, yeah. Do I have extra moves, by the way? It's a mutual suksa. Okay, G3 for now, yeah? G3, exactly. Because otherwise, if you go. Yeah, if you have two moves and I go G3 and one more move, then probably, probably you are fine, yeah? <laughs> but okay, it's not uh, how it is. But he went 97, yeah? He could just play 96 back. He would never lose it, look. Yeah, wow. yeah, yeah. Knight it's a, he, he was, was of so... course thinking that he has the guy has bad bishop. Yeah, he thought that mm -hmm. he has no risk at all because all his pawns are on the white. But it's not how it is. Yeah, it's uh, Tsukson. Uh, the bishop against knight, Tsukson is also a thing. Mm -hmm. Yeah, this is just actually it was also not that hard. He could play knight b8 after uh, after uh, bishop e7. It's, it seems. What is the point? Not to weaken uh, yourself, I guess. Not to allow this Tuk Tsuang. After knight v8, how do you play? Which move? Uh, so... Uh, 48. 48. Yeah, no, the point is I don't even let king to f4. So if ah, I play... king g3, king f5. Oh, yeah, 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 king f5, yeah. yeah. And, you, and and at this point, if the pawn also was on f2, if yeah. the pawn was on f2, mm -hmm. you would be winning. Because of? f3. And then if knight d7 back? Then I go... Oh, wait. No, but I think he only lost because he allowed king to f4. If he plays f6 or knight b8, it's okay. King g3, king f5, right? Mm -hmm. yeah, actually, he he actually uh, made some kind of self, self, uh, you know, like suicide. Long, yeah. He completely took one. He first of all put a knight on d7, and then he allowed uh, king to f4. Mm -hmm. Yeah, wow, knight f6. Stuff. Wait, knight f6 now? Let me see what the position is. G3, 53rd move, knight f6. Knight f6, king e5. Knight e8. And now just wait a move and play it as a big one. In uh, my game, it pawns already on f6. 
but what is your pass f4 yeah? oh yes. sorry sorry there was my game where i trapped nihal's knight i understand what you mean another one uh, i trapped right. the knight on c1 right somewhere yeah 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 yeah, yeah. no no there was there was another game where um, max had bishop on the 6 dominating the knight but i trapped yeah. him uh, in the on c1 yeah yeah true true and there's also a super chat from shriram which says pune tete kai une i don't know what it means uh, let maybe i can translate what was it uh, pune t i t h e kai u n e uh actually somehow failed to understand what it means sorry okay uh how can that be is that not your language or uh... i actually think there might be a typo which which is which makes me unable to understand that you sound like a google translate you know like um, uh, there might be a typo which makes me unable to translate this can you suggest can you suggest alternative <laughs> spelling perhaps also no i, I sound like siri yeah <laughs> See, yeah yeah you are sound like this google translate simply yeah. uh, guys good news good news uh, uh one member of indian uh, youth team is going to sleep which is excellent news oh wow. for the for the for the future of the country so for, yeah, of your for country the future of the so country but not for the chat immediately yeah? not for the chat No, no, but uh, you know, more important, the future of uh, of Indian chess. True, true. Yeah, so yeah, this is just lost. Black pick, white, white picks up the a6 pawn, and the bishop on d8 controls h4. So that's should be. Or does black have some counterplay? Like, um, like for example, was, my point G7? was yeah, like my point was like knight g7, for example, king d6. Knight of yeah. King C7. King C7. Yeah. Okay, I probably need to take on G3 first. King B7. F6. Unlikely. I mean, I will take yeah. F6. Okay, I'll take. I have Bishop C7. Yeah, indeed. I have Queen King A6. H4. And right. Ah, right. F Bishop C7 kills the kills. And I'm the... so much faster. Yeah. Yeah. And yeah. yeah. No, no, you're like 10 tempi down. No, it's mm -hmm. hopeless. My my. There was worse. a trap. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, actually, Naka is kind of defending. Yeah. very tenacious as he always does he is very very uh, resourceful man very resourceful so resourcefulness comes from uh, good tactics yeah in general uh you probably yeah, probably a good uh, short calculation yeah like um quick calculate short quick calculate yeah. yeah probably yeah it's a type of instinct no i mean sometimes you just see all this uh, tricky stuff or how does it work mm -hmm. no if it's instinct i think it's a short calculation i don't think that's uh, i mean hikaru himself calls it instinct but i think he uh, hikaru for example himself he thinks he's an intuitive player you know mm -hmm. yeah i think it's i mean i don't think that's the case at all i think he is uh, he's calculating so fast that he thinks it's intuition but it's just calculation mm -hmm. I mean, I don't think that he has a feel for where piece should go. I think he just calculates it so fast yeah. uh, that within half a second he feels it should go there after did after doing calculations, yeah, in the head. Not after like uh, like Magnus, for example, he just feels piece should go there and he doesn't calculate at all, yeah. Right. Right. Uh, I mean, he can cal calculate, but like he can also not. But Hikaru, he always calculates. If you look at his stream, always he says this, this, that, that. You know, always yeah, some yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. hundred arrows. <laughs> Yeah, like he is constantly calculating, and uh, I really like that he said that uh, Fabiano is a calculating player, which is true. But he said that yeah, I am intuitive. I mean, that's okay. Wow. Kind of... <laughs> I think it's related to Fabi. Yeah. Yeah. Well, but no, but okay, they're both uh, calculating uh, players. Yeah. But this looks like a sort of a fortress, right? Ninety five, ninety three. Yeah. Also, yeah, it's completely fine. Yeah. Because um, King B five as well also come if Black tries to. I mean, yeah. it's really not. I don't even think Black can push because he has no ideas at all. Yeah, if mm -hmm. D four King C four, he should just. I vaguely uh, thought that Black will try for some F four at some point, but he just can't get it. Ah, F four Knight yeah, F four. Yeah, we have a draw on four. Also, it's a draw between uh, Ali Reza against Grishchuk. Your uh, chess bra teammates. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, you know, sometimes you can get very surprising teammates. Yeah, like, uh, like for example, Grishuk and Alireza and me. Yeah, it's a very surprising team. Like, you have to really come up with uh, 
Yeah, it's, uh, so there is nothing in common at all between all of us, but uh, we are all Chisbra suddenly. Magnus, by the way, winning again somehow. Oh, but how? I, I, I'm just, I was calculating that, couldn't find it. Can you see the win? Uh, no, no, I just saw here the, the bar was saying it's very good, but uh, let's see. Um, I think, ah, so a5. So it's knight e5, threatening knight c6, I guess. So I might want to go rook d8. Uh, rook d8, then there is rook e8, yeah? Rook, yeah, that is, but I get that. Is that rook d7? No, knight g6, knight g6, knight g6. Yes, yes, mate. Oof. It's very nice, yeah, yes, mate. How, how, how? I missed the variation. I was drawing all around on the board. Uh, yeah, you know, if you keep chatting, of course you'll miss everything. But uh... <laughs> no, he plays it. Ah, okay, I see what you're saying. Yeah, rook e8. Oh, king e2. And uh, it's not, it's not winning now, is it? Wait, wait, what wait, 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 yeah. he's, not, he's not even, he's not even pushing. What happened? Oh my God. He didn't find rook e8? Yeah. Come on. But this is elementary, man. It's just mate in three. And now black is the one. What? Black is actually, okay, now, okay, no, knight of six is but there. But this is, but this is so basic now. Is it basic? Wait, is black winning now? What winning? How black is winning? Like, I wouldn't oh. be totally shocked. No, but I, it should be drawn, huh? Yeah. Should be draw or I actually. I mean, the sure. thing is with the three pawns on FF, 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 I know it's lost. Okay, it's of mm -hmm. course lost. But okay, I don't think you get it, yeah. Oh, but he went rookie two. Now king d5 is dead, yeah. There's nothing to do. Just checks, oh, yeah, after king yeah, on d6. Yeah, yeah, king d6 and then checks, yeah. You cannot cross mm -hmm. with the king. Yeah, yeah. Uh, he wanted to cross with the king to b8, but it's never happening because I just uh, rook a8 check after king d8. Maybe he should have just, oh, instead wow. of all these rook moves, just tried to bring the king. He had to. Uh, oh, but rook eight was a big, him. big miss. Rook eight is just made in three. It's just remarkable. Wow. Yeah. Wow. But do you think something like this, that like, uh, probably not with Carlson, but some players, if some players don't have a good score with someone and they have it in their, like they have this psychological block in their mind, then they just somehow, even in good positions, fail to convert or. Fail yeah, but hold. usually uh, Magnus usually uh, sees this, yeah, because he always expects, yeah. uh, he's always looking for uh, winning opportunities, yeah. Right. Uh, if it was the way around, I could imagine that Jeffrey would think that okay, maybe you know he messed up and Magnus is doing well. But, uh, but wow, you, just, you know, you know that, guys, really guys, but you know what is amazing? He had rookie eight twice, yeah. He could do it twice. Oh, twice, yeah. He could do it immediately and after King E two A four as well. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The same. But he was focused on this. Oh my God! But he thought what? He thought he's losing or what? Yeah, probably. Yeah. He no, was but okay. Forward. But look, okay. But look, if you oh, but he didn't see it. Look, he could even play knight h4, 46. He didn't see this mate, yeah. But it's a uh, kind of strange because it's really out there, not this mating net. Yeah, even I missed it to be honest. I thought rook d7 holds, but yeah. No, but you I'm just trying to understand Magnus like. I mean, he, you know, he had this 95 also move before, yeah? He had it all the time. Like, also, he could play the king of 395. Yeah, he just missed. He com I understand what it is. So, he completely missed this idea of the 95 rook 8 mm -hmm. And then, uh, and then of course, if you don't see it, then he thought, actually, he is much worse. He was mm -hmm. trying to make a draw, actually. Right. But if he but wanted I a draw, he could have achieved it in... Many how, though? No, but I don't think... Okay, look. So, uh, on move 41, he can play rook takes e3, yeah? So he yes. played rook e7 for some reason, playing for a win, of course, yeah? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Playing for a win. Then the guy goes knight c4, he was d7, the guy goes knight b6. Yeah, and but for example, after knight b6, if he wants a draw, he takes on f5, right? Oh, no, that's not a draw. Oh, yeah, it yes. is a draw. Yeah, uh, I was also thinking of this knight f5 move. Yeah, no, if knight... he wants a draw, he played knight g6, sorry. He played knight g6 move 43. Mm -hmm. Knight g7, knight f8, right? It's a draw. King f8, rook e3, and it's, it's Right, fine. right, right. So he was playing for a win with king g2. Then the guy goes king h7, knight g6, ah yeah, he missed king h7, knight g6, rook b8, the rook 8 knight d7 was there, you see? So after he missed that, because rook 8 knight takes d7, covering mm -hmm. the b8 rook, yeah. then he probably panicked. He thought like, okay, maybe I messed up and maybe ah, it's, okay. uh, yeah, yeah, maybe that. 
But it's kind of very weird, yeah. I mean, this rookie eight was always there, and he should see such things usually. He always sees wins, but okay. Yeah, Wesley won. Uh, are the games over? Which would be great, because then I can play with uh, Srinath again. Yeah, I think. Uh, yeah, yeah, I think yeah. yeah. Oh, nice. I don't, nice. Okay. Yeah. Okay, yeah. Srinath, so uh, Mr. Baggins, please. Uh... <laughs> yeah. And thank you, thank you, Rahul, for the super chat. Okay. Are you cashing in, yeah? While uh, we're you cashing in, nice, nice. Guys, keep the super chats alive, guys. Yeah. Did he also say something nice? Uh, ah, he said Magnus decided... must have trusted his intuition and. <laughs> yeah, yeah, no, but you see, uh, uh, yeah, yeah. Right? Jokes aside, no, he's a great calculator, but uh, of course, uh, by nature, he's an intuitive player rather than. Uh, mm -hmm. But okay. He's, uh, of course, master of everything, yeah? Yeah. yeah. I was not okay, expecting so... E4. So we play this very uh, trendy line. Knight F3, they don't start with because of BG4, but it's still uh, fine. Ashir, if you have any uh, good suggestions for me, feel free to comment it, but... Not for Anish. Yeah. yeah. Oh, sh I should not comment it, yeah? In <laughs> Well, I can, I can, I can, we can hear you. Mm -hmm. Yeah, maybe I'll keep quiet. But I think you can talk about uh, stuff in general. What it you can uh, write, in, uh, write in the chat. Uh, yeah. well, like is... Srina style. Depressing question. I mean, now I can't. I think I can start commentating. You anticipated that one, yeah. Yeah, of course. I know the desperate uh, Mr. Baggins. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, I really wasn't expecting E4. That's, you You blame everything on first move, yeah? <laughs> well, kind of. I got a... I mean, I think I think after after the first move, you still have chances usually in bullet games. But uh, yeah, you can, you can blame it all on the first move. That's possible. Yeah, so this line was played by Rapport today. G6. Oh, I think I already like black. Such a biased commentary. <laughs> Actually, it's objective. I think it's both biased and objective. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah, I mean, whoever is watching, I'm sure, is pretty excited for the cricket action coming up after two days. <laughs> <laughs> I feel I don't know which commentator is worse. The one who didn't say anything and then said after three games, yes, so games are interesting. <laughs> <laughs> the one who, start, who starts talking about cricket simply during the, the games. I mean, come on. No, guys. because you can hear it. No, that's why I didn't. Ah, okay. You try to distract us simply then. Uh... <laughs> Knight a4, queen b3 is quite nice, yeah? Just to to cover some key squares on queen side. Nice. Well, I don't see how it's nice. G6. 
so some theoretical battle going on in bullet some famous team switch games here yeah but we don't know about them so we don't think it's theoretical <laughs> no no yeah p4 very tip, very nice idea So what about cricket? Uh, we are curious. What happens with cricket? No, the biggest. I mean, Indian Premier League starts day after tomorrow. It's mm -hmm. huge, completely. Huge. Yeah? I mean. So chess streaming stops, yeah, or what? <laughs> no, chess streaming doesn't stop because of the. I mean, but in general, people start to play a lot more cricket in India once IPL starts. So you mean on the streets or what? Yes, yes. Uh, before they play some football, and once they, they like they play in seasons, I think. Mm -hmm. Yeah, Anish is dominating. Queen c4, cheapo idea. Uh, even uh, even the intelligence doesn't help. I think I should try my. I have to completely focus. Yeah, Anish took control over the position. Severely really biased commentary continues. Very nice. <laughs> yeah, With Dashper Bishop. Okay, yeah, Srinath is fighting. Yeah, G6. Very nice. Bishop B4. Strong performance. Very nice. D5, Rook into E4 was the threat, guys. Sudden. Very sudden. I've become so slow. No, I think you are just because you like maybe on stream that's why. Otherwise, you are quite fast. Yeah, normally you are fast. Maybe it's age, man. Maybe it's age. Yeah, true. <laughs> the last few months. So do you age quick quickly during quarantine? Probably, yeah. Like in space, you age much faster in space and uh, during quarantine. Yeah, yeah. Very such a paradox. Opposite color has a drawing tendency, but with uh, queens on the board, the attacking side is really very strong. Yeah, now it's over. Oh my god, PG6 is such a nasty move. <laughs> oh my god. Oh man, I'm so rolling, man. Yes. Yeah. You have, you, you, like, Srinath is. Half adopted. Semi adopted, yeah. Oh my God! What what I will receive from Nihal after this, man? <laughs> oh, I'm angry. He'll he will go. You know, he'll complain to Nihal that Nihal this guy bullied he's me. Going he's, he's going to avenge Srinath. He's going to avenge. Uh, I'm already I'm already hurt, man. From all the I already imagine what's gonna happen to me. Oh, angry sure. angry Nihal is just uh, very bad. Yeah, it actually uh, happened like that uh, with Hari once. He also got avenged him. Yeah. 
Yeah, very interesting position. But in general, the one who attacks towards the king is in bullet at least much easier to play. No, I thought for once I got a good position and uh, I might get some nice comments, but no. <laughs> <laughs> no, but either you know, either your position is not good or it's practically not good. Something he always finds, yeah. Yeah. Okay, now I'm not. I don't like. Black's position at all, but yeah, knight of it. I knight a to knight before should have played quickly. Black is trying to hold. Oof. Nish is finding good counter play. Oh. He lost the whole house there. Rook A3 mate. Oh. Has taken up some momentum. Very nasty. Oh, God. Oh, even mouse slips. That always happens like this. Okay, finally, finally. finally. Oh no! <laughs> oh, what a bloody guy! That's insane because of the mouse slip. Because of the mouse. Oh but, my god! This but is, okay, so that was already a mate. Yeah. Oh wait, wait, wait! Sorry, sorry. It was already mate. Yeah, already yeah, yeah. It. yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, it was not just the mouse slip. I already blundered mate. Yeah. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, fair enough, fair enough, fair enough. Okay, last one. Oh, right. I was going to say when it pours, it when it rains, it pours, but but it's not true. When it rains, it just rains, guys, and then it's all fine. It, <laughs> rain. it stops raining. It's simply how it is. Yeah. It just stops raining at some point. Just keep waiting. Yeah, but it's very important to learn how to stay calm after such mistakes. So you will see how Anish bounces back. <laughs> announced, already announced my comeback. Nice. Yeah, there's a... Oh, F4 should have, would have been crushing for white. Oh, my bishop would be dead, yeah? That's true. Yeah. Didn't realize that. Oh, it's still dead. <laughs> yeah. Okay, maybe if I would... Try to close everything, but we'll see. So cheat act F4, very strategical play. Wow. High quality chess. Oh, blunder. Oh my god. You should never call something off. <laughs> Yeah, strong players always get lucky. Yeah, oh yeah, very nice. Very now it's over. Okay. I no, but Srinath played okay. very well. But yeah. okay, guys, uh, I think the game starts now. Yeah, yeah, game. Starts. Oh yeah. And Firuja is playing. Thank you for the games. Thank you for the games. <laughs> okay. Oh. oh, he plays this d3 line and then. He, he goes for this perk setup with where black has one extra move, but still has to prove 
uh, equality. Okay, Nihal will avenge me. For sure. <laughs> but for that, Anish should play. Yeah? <laughs> oh, he will play, he will play. <laughs> Tomorrow, Nihal will tune in yeah, during the broadcast. Suddenly, like, hello, uh, we have a guest. Sinas will be like, so we'll be more calm than usual. He'll be there. So, um, today we have a guest with us. Please, everyone, welcome to Nihal study. You can have the floor, Nihal. You can play some bullet games with Anish. And Sinas will just watch. And after every three losses of mine, he will say, very interesting games. <laughs> <laughs> and okay. he'll type in the chat, you know, like always. Yeah. <laughs> but okay, he he, uh, he doesn't come anymore on my streams after he uh, went to your stream. Now he says he uh, streams only with uh, people about 27 and 50. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. No, it's okay, it's okay. So, so we so gotta this... do it on your stream. You want uh, public humiliation, yeah, on top of uh, vengeance. What is this? Wow. Carlson went for this Dragodorf, yeah? Amazing. Wow. This is such rubbish, no? This is yeah. such rubbish. Jesus, wow. <laughs> no, this D3... actually likes this opening quite a bit. For black or? Uh, yeah, for black. I mean, uh, I think in I, I think bullet, I have... yeah, but... No, no, even in uh, classical chess, uh, I think I have uh, uh, vetoed it about five times so far. You know that there is also this game, uh, Levon against Lanier, in this line that uh, Harshit was saying, no? In the Italian. Yes, Levon has yeah. Which this Bishop H three? You mean? Yeah, no, that's that's one on Italian. That uh, the, the one that I yeah yeah. Without the eight, ah, right. six. Yeah, yeah 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 exactly this one I meant Queen C eight yeah that like this pawn sacrifice. No, it's not a pawn sacrifice, but this like it engine gives very slight advantage when I had last check, but Black has mm -hmm. e like equal results. Yeah. In yeah, it's uh, not not a big deal. This, yeah. by the way, this system is not so bad. Yeah, this Dragodorf, according to the Lila. Actually, so Lila, bad. yeah, Lila does not like it, uh, say it's so bad, but Stockfish gives a big advantage. Mm -hmm. But yeah. I mean, Bishop But it's just, I mean, it has to be very, very, very dubious. Yeah, like he plays a6, g6, and h5. It seems a bit over the top, and White is very flexible in his setup. Mm -hmm. But I don't know. But the problem is for White, like, what, uh, like he. He needs to choose some things to some setups. Mm -hmm. Yeah, if uh, the engine likes to go short castle actually, or he likes the engine likes to wait a bit. Bishop e two first. Mm -hmm. If you go long castle first, then there is b five first. Actually, something. I'm not fully sure if I remember correctly that bishop c four is the best move. It has a reputation maybe of being yeah, the best, yeah, but I, it's some old. Uh, best. Yeah, I think I think it's some old uh, old theories. Bishop c four is the way. Yeah, yeah. But it's probably yeah. old. But the modern comp says bishop just, for example. Yeah. Ah, you know what's the point of the comp? The comp is basically it's a waiting uh, for the move b5. So if you go long castle, I go b5. But and if then you go a4 first, bishop to first, b5, and then a4. Yeah. So uh, bishop to okay. probably knight b7, and then the engine goes for example h3. He waits again for b5, a4, and if not b5, then long castle. That's oh, it was h3. I, I I thought more intuitive is to go g3 and then h3, but okay. Yeah, but h3, h4, if black goes, he says short castle and then f4 and uh, f5. Ah, like and... that. Okay. Okay, Very this is first line of Lila. I don't know if it's uh, the best, but it's first line that are uh, oh, interesting stuff. But of course, he, he knows, Magnus knows that nobody knows this. Uh, so yeah. he hopes that the guy starts playing over the board. Mm -hmm. It's uh, very Ooh. relevant to who he's playing against, yes. Of course, yeah. He's always trying to play against the opponent, yeah? It's it's how you have to play, not the opening these days. You have to prepare for opponent. Actually, h3 is very interesting because you can you can directly even play f4 without castling anywhere. Mm -hmm. And then to just to see what black is doing. But and maybe at what point? I, I lost you. So uh, after queen 2 h5, the engine goes bishop e2. Yeah, bishop e2. And bd7, that is the first line. And now yeah. h3. Ah, OK. So the point is that I guess b5, a4. Yeah. And okay, yeah. you h3. h3 also, yeah, it's true. It's not such a bad move. Yeah. You maybe sometimes go f4 later. Mm -hmm. Yeah, bishop b3. He's also waiting, I guess. Huh. 
And now he goes to C5. <laughs> long castle and long castle whenever white plays black has to worry about some E5 tricks. Okay, now the king is on C1, so no, but otherwise. But isn't, and... uh, isn't it like a pleasant position even after sh uh, short castle? And uh, put your rooks? Uh, in, in general, yeah. Well, okay, but I mean, then at least it's a, it's a position, yeah? Yeah, true. But I think uh, Black has already position. achieved that, no? After this bishop c4, bishop b3, knight c5. Yeah, you were right, yeah? This, he waited for long castle and then he played to e5, so... Yeah, that's a... Uh, makes sense, yeah? It's pretty logical. I think it's, mm -hmm. a, it's a thing in some neither positions as well, yeah? Like, it's a, it's a theme. Mm -hmm. Maybe king b1 now, yes? Or... I am wondering, this Alireza, yeah? It is what it's prep or what was he doing this fast this nonsense this queen yes d6? yes yes it's prep yeah 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 queen d6 i think i must i mean because this f i mean engine first it shows it's uh, like good for white this line mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. so uh, yeah but, but queen d6 uh, knight d7 is prep and then it's okay yeah what wow strange oh, i didn't know that g6 is also okay no i i, I mean d takes e4 is main move also queen c7 is there but g6. yeah g6 actually it was not supposed to be the main move also, because of e5 right because of e5 and there was an aronian game which highlighted just that i think yeah i played also some blitz game with uh, mamiz yarov i played e5 and you know he played the move i think he played d4 oh that's uh that it's, should... a, it's a bad move but it yeah. looks logical but it's pretty bad did it look logical well he like what was the stops... point he stops d4 and he wants to isolate my e5 pawn and win it. Yeah, c5, knight, c6, mm -hmm. bishop, c7. But uh, actually, I was kind of worried because I was worried to lose it. Yeah, simply the pawn. Yeah, it's very it confrontational. Happened. But we have to start uh, talking about. Uh, we have to like people have to sh uh, see what we're talking about. I uh, have or it. On we the have, board. I have it. On the you board. have, yeah. You follow. Yeah, yeah. That's, uh, that's why I'm not Otherwise, yeah, I, I otherwise, try okay, to okay. follow you guys. Nice, nice. <laughs> that's, I mean, plan B is always to speak about DiCaprio. Yeah, you know, if you yeah, yeah. this. Um, Getting, uh, if people lose interest, we can always talk about uh, Leonardo. But yeah, I mean, I can see why you guys uh, talk incredibly fast. Yeah, I mean, I'm trying to make the moves, it's, it's not easy. So for the people following... No, I'm just so excited, I mean, to I mean, to get in the insights yeah, of Anish in opening especially. So that's why I might be a bit... Yeah, 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 I understand, I understand. But this, uh, this D4 and this G5 line is also very interesting, yeah? That? Uh, uh, like D into E4, Queen D1, King D1, Knight F6. Sorry, which, which game? Which game? Firuja, Nepomne Nepomneshi Firuja. Ah, okay. Like, it yeah, very yeah. interesting. I mean. G5, H5, black place. Ah, yes, yeah, yes, yeah, yes, yeah, yes. yeah, 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 no, it, no, it's very no but this knight of 3, d3 in general, it's remarkable. I think at some point uh, it was first line of uh, of Leela, yeah? It still uh, is, some... yeah, or no? It still is, yeah, first line, yeah? Wow. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's amazing. Yeah. Amazing. Like, because knight c3 was always the first line, but the problem is in this bishop g4 and some exact move order that you can't play d4 and black takes the pawn on d4, which was previously thought to be very dangerous. Hmm. No, I think, yeah, I think also the point is after bishop g4, uh, I guess you are happy to, h3, bishop f3, queen f3, you're happy to have the knight flexible, yeah? Or you have knight bd2 also, I think, yeah? Bishop g4. That's maybe also the thing. Bishop, yeah. I don't even remember. I think it's h3. I think they don't go bishop g4, like in general, they are giving that bishop after white has committed d4, right? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And that, because if not, then maybe some queen e2, f4, I don't know. Yeah, knight on c3 is maybe misplaced in these positions after bishop g4, h3, bishop f3. So maybe mm -hmm. that's why. Yeah, but d3, it's a it's very timid move, but it's interesting, yeah. Very modern move. Yeah. Black has many ways to play. I mean, it's probably this Alireza does one of them. Actually, Alireza also faced this against Sari Krishna in online Nations Cup and had a very, very bad position after a few moves. So. Yeah. yeah. So I think that's why he decided to make it complex. Ah, he got outplayed in the end game, yeah? 
Yeah, but yeah. Lo- somehow luckily he he uh, somehow luckily he escaped even there. To be honest, he held a draw. Hmm. Yeah, yeah, he tricked him in the end game. Hmm. Yeah, no. Some uh, sometimes these kids are pretty well prepared. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Uh, no, but I'm not sure. I'm not sure about that. I don't think so. Uh, in general, I think no. Yeah, no. I think they aren't. Uh, that's what I say. Sometimes. Uh, yeah. Sometimes. I, I meant to. I meant to say it actually more stressing the word sometimes than the well prepared. Very. <laughs> like I, I think that generally they are not well prepared, but like sometimes they are actually well prepared. Like in this game, for example. Yeah, I understand. And I think you notice, I notice kind of similar stuff with Nihal and uh, Prague and many. Like usually they are out of book, but let's let's say if it's if they guess the opening, then they can. Have, of course, they work with engines and stuff, and they have coaches. No, I think it mainly depends on uh, if that variation is uh, played often in blitz, at least with uh, let's say Ali Reza. <laughs> so now you have this b4, c6, knight of 3 d5, d3, and uh, it's it's all it's there everywhere, yeah. And, All bullet blitz. Yeah, yeah, I know what you mean. You mean if he yeah. faced it hundred times in his blitz games, he yeah, yeah. acknowledges its existence, yeah. Yeah, and of course, then he goes and checks out of curiosity. Mm-hmm. By the way, Anish, do you follow football? Uh, not very closely. Why? No, just I was curious. Ah, there is no follow follow up question. Good, good. No, like I wanted to put you on the spot and ask you if you like CR seven or Messi more, but. Oh, uh, I guess no, I, I guess say, no, no. I see, of course, CR7. I say, um, uh, as a streamer and uh, you know, a friend of uh, <laughs> some some other streamers. Uh, I think yeah. we all have to, we all have to we unanimously all have to agree on yeah. that. Yeah. Yes, yes, yes. It's like like just like I expect everyone also to prefer, uh, you know, to not not like Magnus Carlsen. They also we also <laughs> expect everyone to to like uh, Cristiano Ronaldo. It's, it's the same. Yeah. It's solidarity, solidarity. <laughs> I. My disappointment is there because I am just uh, I'm I'm pro Messi, but yeah. Uh, but you don't have to say these things. Like some people also like <laughs> Magnus Carlsen, but they never actually admit it. <laughs> yeah, uh, I agree with that. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Uh, I stopped admitting it after you came onto my streams. Yeah, I understand. I understand. It's 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 fine. It's fine. You know, it's uh, I I don't want how to say. Um, I don't want you uh, to think the way I want you to think, but I want you to at least pretend that you think the way I want you to think, and that's fine. Hmm. It's really fine. Nice, nicely put. Uh, you know this this Magnus game, a computer at least on uh, I don't know on website. I don't know if it's how good. It says after Bishop B7, some Knight F5 move. Did you see this? GF Bishop C5, D6 Queen G5. Some kind of very pretty tactic, very uh, unusual tactic. Yeah. Uh, well. And then bishop h6, rook d8, rook d8, queen f5. I lost you. Knight f5, right? Ah, Magnus game, yeah. Knight f5, g5, bishop c5, yeah. Yes. And then uh, take take queen g5, bishop h6, take take. But do you think Grishuk will? I mean, with will Magnus be happy? Uh, won't be happy to play that or? To give the queen, yeah. Yeah, like yeah, he just happy, for yeah. some very ex- counter play. Yeah, it's very hard to assess all of these queen down positions. I don't know. Also, especially when someone plays fast, you just never know. Yeah, that is it right, or am I just blundering something? Like C4. True, true, and... true. And Magnus kind of plays a bit fast. Yeah, he's still bluffing. It's a prep. Yeah, yeah. I mean, yeah. But maybe, but Grishuk is Grishuk thinks what his opponent is thinking. He's thinking and then plays. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, what? <laughs> So Grishuk is thinking yeah. what yeah. his opponent is thinking that he is thinking, and then yeah, ah, okay, so then he'll play it actually, yeah, yeah. yeah. No, that's, Grishuk is poker player. Like yeah. Friends, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Do they know what we, we yeah. know that they know? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just playing with words. But in general, isn't Cristiano Ronaldo and Messi aren't they slowly getting older or still not? The the thing is, they are getting older, but the. Biological age sort of affects a lot, I guess. Like, uh, but I mean to say that aren't there supposed to be newer stars? Like I don't know, some kind of Mbappe and all this. Uh, yeah, yeah, they're definitely there. They're. But they're, they're going to overtake, no, at some point soon, I guess, no or not? I guess there's still one or two years for that to happen. Mm-hmm. But yeah. 
Because as far as I remember, Cristiano, he even went to some other club, right? Which was smaller. He's in Juventus now, that's right. Yeah, Juventus, right? It's, but it's more or less like pension or not. I'm no. Not really no, 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 no. It's not really? Not. Because uh, like there were some really good players in that team. Like Buffon was in... Uh, mm-hmm. But okay, in so general, I like, think I like think he's uh, you, on, I think, going to pension slowly. So that's not the case, or what? Yeah, because he might even join Manchester or something like that. Mm-hmm. Who knows? And Barcelona, they had some kind of oh, big, big issue. Big, no? big this, issue. The uh, problem is, no? like, was the they lost. Like the problem is the uh, management had a disaster, like total disaster, and uh, they did not hire good new young players, and everyone mm-hmm. in their team was getting old. Like, ah, okay, okay, okay. And Messi uh, wanted and Messi to leave. Couldn't, Messi couldn't. Yeah, he actually didn't leave finally. Yeah. He no, he couldn't, right? he couldn't leave. Like there would ah, have the been... contract. The contract. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And you know his release contract is like eight hundred million. So, so yeah. the new club has to pay, right or not? Yeah. Like if they want to buy him, but of course no one can pay eight hundred. Oh, by the way, Harry made such a uh, uh, such an unfortunate move. It's f four. It's so weakening. Queen e seven is there, and then all these weak squares and this knight on a three. Oh, mm-hmm. yucky, yucky. No, you know that um, I faced the system also with black few times, uh, but yeah, ah, this, this is just A4, very... yeah, yeah, yeah. But uh, like now, for example, this knight on A3 is this P5 square is not relevant at all. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it's a very unpleasant position. It's actually also Wesley So style, risk free. No, but I must say, this guy Wesley So, you know, sometimes he's uh, it really like he's. So how to say he's playing so simple, yeah, like such simple chess. He's really not trying to stir up any drama, yeah. Mm-hmm. But sometimes he starts winning games in a row anyway, like uh, and very simple, you know, just playing very, very, very solid, very safe, and people start making big mistake after mistake. He already wins second one. Yeah? He won today also earlier game against Levon. Remember similar style out of nowhere. Yeah, 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 yeah. Out of complete nowhere, yeah. And now again, he's going to win out of uh, okay, after, probably out of nowhere, more or less. Do you think so? But yeah, it's a bit you think? Premature, no? Win. Uh, yeah, but I have here bar, and the bar is so completely unhappy. Okay, and I and I can okay. sort of see why, but uh, h5, h4, or how uh, does black play? No, bishop takes b5, I think. Knight b5, queen e2. Mm-hmm. Okay, it's not so simple. B3, c6. DC, BC, knight, G6, C5. Okay, that's unfindable, probably. Oh, very cute, yeah, for the queen, C5, queen, D1. That's very unfindable. And then queen, E3. Uh, but let's let's see. Okay, knight, if he just plays normal... Okay, he also plays C6 first. Yeah, it's early to speak of winning, of course. It's early mm-hmm. to speak of winning. But, I mean, he gets chances, yeah? He gets but chances. But he's on the yeah. better side of... Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. It's, early, it's very early to say winning, of course. Yeah, it's just better for black. But it's... Uh, he's getting chances. Yeah, Grishuk uh, finally thought uh, and decided to think what Magnus thinks he thinks. Magnus thinks he thinks and decided to play A3. Ouch. That doesn't sound exciting. (laughs) (laughs) A3. Okay, but it's still a nice question. But okay, I'm thinking this will end in a row. Oh, really? Um, Amateur prediction. Yeah. Grishuk gets a nice question. Magnus defends it. Peter's out. I always wonder, yeah, such how such complex positions end up in a draw in top level chess. So so many rich ideas. At least like yeah, in you know? 25, 2600, okay, maybe about 2600 it's already very different, but 24, 2600 it's just uh, someone will sacrifice something and then things will happen, yeah? Yeah, but usually I think that the thing that top players they don't make huge mistakes, like they don't make very big ones that are obvious. Mm-hmm. So they always keep some, uh, and also that there is, of course, uh, in chess in general, there is huge, uh, huge draw margin, yeah. Yeah, mm-hmm. huge draw margin. Very big margin. Yeah, yeah. So and also there is a psychological element that both players in such complicated positions, they are not too much against the draw, yeah. Like they are, like if they see a line that leads to simplifications, usually mm-hmm. both are like, because they were both worried that it was too complicated and they could lose. Right. They both don't mind so much that it peters out. You understand? Ah, okay. Like uh, maybe that's all that. Okay, I don't think that's the main reason at all, but it's one of the factors that that affects. Yeah, not, but I think what you to... told first, it it pretty much explains it. Yeah, the huge draw margin. Yeah, but I think it's combination of that. It's it's huge draw margin is the fact that they don't make huge mistakes, 
And it's the fact that they are kind of often, they don't mind so much to meet in the middle. Right. Yeah. They are, they're not like looking forward to it, but they don't mind so much. Let's but say. it has become a lot more fighting now. Yeah. Compared to maybe 15 years ago or something. It's very hard to say. I mean, uh, it depends on the format of the tournament and on uh, uh, stakes and on things, you know, like, for yeah, example, but in general, I used to, uh, I remember seeing some uh, pretty uh, interesting questions between, let's say, a game between uh, Liko and Kaspro and it would suddenly, uh, they would just agree a draw. And I don't see such things happening so often anymore. Yeah, yeah, no, the players no longer just agree a draw anymore because it's not, um, because there is so much attention. And there's a lot of uh, potential criticism, yeah, also. Like, before they could do it and they go, yeah, nobody else tells them anything. And now you have Janta here watching and Janta will be like, hey, why you make draw, you know? Uh, yeah. Why you don't play? Why you agree draw? So that's why. And the so, opportunity cost of playing on and winning is quite big, yeah, nowadays, compared to making a draw. It depends because, on the format, yeah. Uh, because I mean, someone will just race towards the top, yeah? Yes, that's also. And for example, I imagine if, let's say, you have a tournament where there is a... Uh, somebody is leading and there are three rounds left of course then everyone will try to catch him and it will be something yeah mm -hmm. at the same time if you have let's say a tournament where uh you qualify for example for example european individual you don't know about european individual championship what time but it was funny i was uh, at vikan's a tournament uh talking to parimarja negi and it was january and the next tournament was in march so after the end the closing ceremony i say oh parimarja so what's next you're gonna play european uh, individual and he starts laughing at me <laughs> and I think, like, why is he laughing? Uh, yeah. Everybody is individual, no? Huh? Because in Europe, everybody, like, all the yeah, players yeah, yeah. play. And, yeah, but it's not, you guys don't know it, but basically the idea, it's like, it's like Asian zonal, yeah? Yeah, Asian yeah, yeah, But Asian only gives you two places or something, right? How many places? Five. Three, five, five, only five. Yeah. European gives you, like, 24 places or something. Right. So, at some point, there is, like, a bunch of players, and they've already, um, they, four rounds before the end, if they make four draws, they are in yeah, the top yeah, 20. Yeah, yeah. And I they know. all make draw after draw after draw. Yeah. After. Like, because it's just like, you're just there. It's just, you know, uh, qualifying basically by force. Yeah, 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 I know, I know. And it's just unbearable. And, but it's very funny because like, there is always that one or two guys who actually want to win the tournament because there is better prize money and they want to win it. But yeah. most of them just want to qualify too. So you have like, usually like, let's say last round, uh, top 10 games, like nine finish in a draw and one is fighting yeah, for the first place or something. It's kind yeah. of funny. But uh, yeah, it depends on the tournament situation. Yeah? And also in this rapid blitz, I think everybody's fighting. Because, okay, also what is there to lose? Who cares? Mm -hmm. To be honest, like this position of Grishuk is a, like, can go wrong for him, right? For Grishuk? Or, or he just goes Bishop D4 next. Ah, okay. Bishop D4 next and he just solidifies the king side, yeah? It can, but uh, it shouldn't, I guess, because this B3, A3, B2 is very nicely for the king, very safe for the king, no? Mm -hmm. Super safe king. Yeah. yeah, I guess. And bishop I... D4, yeah, very nice. If E5, you would go back and D6 is weak. Yeah, true. But I don't know, hard to say, hard to say. Queen's With Carlson, it... always can happen, yeah, stuff. Yeah. Like, Where's sometimes the... it just feels like... Uh, like you just don't understand. Like, okay, not uh, maybe not with uh, like if you and all the guys, but like for for some audience like me and like some of my friends, I just fail to understand the logic. Yeah, like some moves are like so deep. Like of Carlson, you mean? Yeah, like, like yeah, yeah. No, he sometimes can play very deep chess. Yeah, yeah. He is sometimes capable of playing just uh, also in blitz and rapid. Especially yeah, rapid. it's crazy. I mean, yeah. oh, he can play very very deep. The thing is, uh, he uh, he is a bit like, uh, at least I for me I noticed he's a bit like a computer with bugs. Yeah, sometimes he has bugs, <laughs> and you have to just kind of uh, try to stay oh. keep some level. Yeah, which is decent of yours, Today. and hope and hope that he will malfunction at some point. And he does like regularly he has bugs. Wow. But uh, otherwise he's like a computer a little bit. That is a keen observation. <laughs> <laughs> no, so I, like, I have a feeling, let's say, that if, let's say, uh, he doesn't have bugs, then you, you will just not have a chance, no matter what you do. But the point is that he will have it, so then you should try to stay And you pounce on that, yeah? It, and it, you have to, yeah, yeah. It reminds yeah. me of what uh, Agassi said about Sampras, you know, how Sampras plays oh, yeah, the yeah. machine. Pete's, yeah, yeah. Yeah. But then Agassi finally got some revenge, yeah? Well, Anish also gets his revenge quite often, yeah, I think. Uh, well, I mean, I didn't. I, I beat him in one match, yeah, in the Smugglers Invitation. And then they changed but... it to best of three. Sorry? And then they changed it to best of three. Yes, 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 yes. <laughs> but uh, no, but of course, I'm uh, yet to play an important match with him, yeah. It's not so far, it's not, not been that uh, crucial. Yeah. 
But uh, you could see in the World Championship matches, for example, Karakin played the brilliant match. He was defending, yeah, for the whole match. Yeah. And then one time he got a chance, he grabbed it, and then yeah. he almost won the match this way. Yeah. Amazing. Yeah. 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 No, you have to just be very, very tenacious. But of course, yes, uh, he sometimes can play for very, like, the level can be super high, yeah. Yeah. So, by the way, plays masterfully. Look, he just very clean. Look, he just, he simply took on b5, check, and knight g7, knight to 5 Just nothing. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Uh, very nasty. By the way, Firuja has made a, done an incredible job of... Uh, he's just uh, overtaking, yeah? Like, at, I mean, at least he's completely safe. Minimum. Yeah, yeah, he has tremendous compensation for the... Yeah. Today, uh, Nepo has been a bit on tilt, yeah? Or, okay, I, I remember at least uh, two games. One against Jeffrey, where he just blended. And... Uh, Second against the Domingos. Jeffrey's game was yesterday, of course. Guys, uh, I will get the tea, yeah? I'll come back. I'll get some oh, tea. Sure. Yeah, sure. Yes. <laughs> I wanted to say something which wouldn't sound good at all, but okay. Something about Magnus? No. <laughs> now, it, now it's just us, yeah? <laughs> <laughs> No, but you're uh, pretty good at streaming. I think you should also have your own channel. Yeah, actually, to be honest, I really like, I mean, interacting and because it's so much, for example, even when we are streaming, we are learning so much about things. Yeah, 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 yeah so absolutely. Yesterday I was tuning in, in the chat, I was talking, I, w I also had a question which I, I was uh, fortunate enough to be answered and like the people have so much, I mean, the people, are, the ones who stream just are... Uh, Amazing, I think. Yeah, 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 absolutely. I just somehow I'm finding it hard to find a lot of time with my education, but I'll definitely try to do something. I mean, uh, for example, yesterday you were just tuning in the chat, right? Uh, watching the Saint Louis. Yeah. And uh, so if you're doing that, then why, why not just do it with the people? Right, right. It's the same thing, yeah? It's mm -hmm. not like you're specifically uh, dedicating time. True. Yeah, that is a good point. Which is what Anish was uh, telling about Fabi yesterday. Yeah? yeah, I mean, the point which he mentioned yesterday, yeah, the Grishuk, you th we think what is Grishuk doing? Of course, he's also studying chess. That was a very good point. Yeah. So. Aronian seems to have a nice position against uh, Domingos. Actually, yeah, I was going to ask about that. So he allows this bishop into f3, eh, which might seem counterintuitive for one too many people. Mm -hmm. Well, not with this bishop on b3 and a post. That's, that, that is a fair point. I guess, yeah, the the pros just outweigh the cons quite heavily, I guess, Yeah. in that trade-off. Yeah. yeah, it's much easier for me to talk when there's only one person. Yeah, You and Anish are analyzing at such high speed and I'm making, trying oh, yeah. to make all these moves on the board. <laughs> Yeah. yeah, I should probably tone it down, yeah? Um, well, uh, I think it's okay because uh, it's not every day that we analyze with Anish. And... Mm -hmm. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, now I guess f4, queen g4, I would even consider trading the queens unless I blunder something immediately. Ah, yes. Uh, the people are asking... Uh... The people are asking about this uh, Hare Krishna's game, which doesn't look good at the moment. Oh. But how is the uh, black making progress? Because uh, if you take queen b2, then... Uh, you give c7. Yeah, you give c7. But this king is so weak, yeah? In, like, white's king. Like, knight f5, where do you go? Queen e4, okay. Yeah, queen e4 already c3 is hanging, so... But uh, they have repeated uh, how many times? Two times, yeah? Yeah, I guess queen g1... Oh, yeah, I think they will make a draw. In general, uh, they are very happy. With, I mean, Black is happy with the draw, yeah? You're talking about Wesley? No, just in general. Yes. I mean, okay. But I'm not like, sure because uh, uh, he can probably keep the game going on here with some Queen E2. Mm -hmm. is it, queen uh, E2, I happened? was considering, but then if you take on C7, I was a bit unsure. Like Queen E7, like for example, uh, queen E2, Knight C7, Queen into B2, yeah? Mm hmm. 
and then i have the sneaky queen a7 move which i thought could look dangerous at least yeah 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 definitely definitely and the point is that i have all this queen a8 knight a8 tricks that it wouldn't be surprising if black just ends up being cornered right Well, if uh, Wesley repeats Queen D two, I'd be quite happy. Yeah, this is. Um... Yeah, he goes for F four, which I thought was very interesting. Aronian. Yeah, F four or Knight moves, and then Queen comes to G four. After which, White controls a lot of light squares. Yes, that's well. Yeah, that's exactly right. What she not said, uh, and after I mean, queen g4, g4, and I think white's position is strategically, I mean, all crushing. Yeah, just. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just controlling all the light squares. Yeah, black cannot put anything on uh, these squares. Yeah. Which, uh, which is like basically like living in Mumbai. Yeah. <laughs> you, you have a lot of pieces, but you don't have any space. Yeah, yeah. That's a nice analogy. Yeah, but uh, he doesn't also have any other option apart from uh, knight g6. Mhm. Mm True. Oh, uh, why? Uh, where else would you put the knight? Like, does c6 run into? Yeah, c6 just looks bad. Yeah. Yeah. You mean some knight g5? Mhm. Mm oh wow. Yeah, knight g5 just crushes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And the point is, guys, that after knight g6 you have knight f8 back, yeah? Or no? Where, where, where? How? It's sorry. Knight g6, knight g5. If I go, then you will have knight f8 back. Knight no? f, knight h8. H8. Wow. No, no, no. I don't understand. Knight g6, knight g5. Then now what? I yeah. I mean, if bishop g5, then at least you will have knight ah, f8. Ah, okay. Yeah, I mean. Bishop. Yeah, yeah. Sorry, I uh, really became. But okay, that portion is lost. Yeah, lost, yeah, yeah, because yeah. rook d8 will come. So I'm yeah. think, sir. I mean, what will black do? Very tough position. Maybe knight h8. He has to make a ugly move. No, but that is lost. Yeah. Then what to do? Yeah. Just position is lost. Then. <laughs> yeah, it's a terrible position. Yeah, and it became bad so quickly. Huh? Yeah. Yeah. It looked. Uh... Hi. Hi. Oh, what's up? Who's bad? Uh, uh, Domingos. Domingos. Yeah, it's so hard though, when you can double the pawns, you get really excited, but then you shouldn't forget that other factors also play a role. <laughs> yeah, it's very hard, yeah. I mean, I also struggle very often on the other side of it, because I, I would think that, you know, I double this pawn, so I have good position, right? Because of this very ugly pawn structure. Right. Yeah, yeah. But, uh, sometimes, despite that, especially because of this bishop on g3, yeah, it's a very nice combination always when you have this double ruined pawns that there's a bishop on g3, it kind of like cements it a bit. It's such a, I mean, such a fantastic position. Yeah, two knights on b6, g6, and two bishops on b3, g3, dominating totally. Yeah. Okay, I would just like to make this Hindi analogy. This Srinath will relate. Yeah, we should. Call... Maybe Anish will also. Yeah, he's yeah. half Indian. Uh, now they see us. Now half half Indian. Uh, कोने में घोड़ा काम करे थोड़ा. Yeah, 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 yeah. Did you understand this? I know yeah, the Goda yeah. is uh, is a knight because uh, I know that it's also has to be Goda has to be respected also. This I also know. <laughs> yeah, so it's like it is the Hindi version of knight on remis dem basically. Ah, oh, okay, okay. But uh, I think it sounds better, yeah. Like yeah, yeah, it always sounds better in your native language though. I mean, it's not my native language, but yeah. Uh, but I uh, think knight on remis dem even the British are disappointed with this uh, saying. <laughs> They're like, uh, not really proud of that one now. I mean, it's not really very sophisticated saying, yeah. Knight on the rim is dim. Yeah. So what now? Yeah, knight if I some tactical answer might be there to just finish black. Finish maybe not so easy, but uh, it would say queen g4 already looks very good. Yeah, yeah that, actually, uh, queen g4 could have been done uh, without knight g5 also, no? Yeah, that is what I thought. Also. But that doesn't look uh, very uh, Aronianistic, yeah. Yeah, maybe Aronian will find some tactic. Let's see.
Uh, it's nice to see Harshit not shying away with the super GM. Nice to see Anish sharing experience and Srinath's subtle humor. Thank you, KVY. Yeah, yeah it's, it's just... a strange, uh, strange uh, super chat. Thank you, of course, but. Uh... <laughs> Anything will do, yeah. In particular, the last uh, sentence is. Uh... <laughs> you mean the <laughs> last humor. part of the sentence, yeah? Yeah. You think there's no humor or no subtlety? Um, <laughs> is it one or the other? Um, <laughs> well, it could be yeah, both. Also. A, uh, yeah, yeah, no, it's it's probably very subtle, very subtle, very nice, very nice. No, it's good stuff, good stuff. Actually, very yeah. nice comment. It's true. It's nice that nobody gets shy away and stuff. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, it's, of course, when you uh, beat someone, you know, uh, somebody blunders you uh, uh, a, a piece in a bullet game, then you don't have to be shy yeah, in front of the person anymore. Oh, no, no. I mean, yeah. of course, I have huge respect. I mean, that is not. Yeah, we, it was before our bullet uh, games. No, oh, no. <laughs> You've crushed me on your stream, so that was bad enough. <laughs> ah, yeah, yeah. In the title Tuesday, right? We played. Yeah, yeah, yeah. True, true. Unfortunately, after that, I didn't uh, finish so well, but yeah, it was a highlight maybe of, uh, maybe it was my best game in that day. Yeah. I was thinking if c4 wins the piece immediately, but I guess you start with bishop g5 and stuff goes on. Uh, for uh, ah, c4, yeah, then, sorry, bishop takes g5 or what? Ah, bishop yeah. takes g5. Talking about uh, Aronian, yeah? Yeah. Oh, he goes knight f3 back, okay. Oh, this is so good. Wow. Knight of 3? No, just the position. Yeah, I mean, you can just Knight dream three, of beautiful. this position. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And Bad the time, point yeah. is, yeah, yeah. Like the Unless problem I'm... is, after f5, you can't even go to b6. This is so sad. Where do you go? Like after c4, I mean. Yeah, I must say that the pawns reunited. Yeah, the F and G pawns they reunited um, really beautifully. Yeah. Guys, can we look at some other games? Yeah. yeah. Otherwise, uh, uh, Harjit already he will, you know, he's enjoying this too much a little bit. <laughs> yeah. Okay, I get the hint. You understand? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> so, Grischuk or Hari Krishna? Uh, let's see. No, Grischuk. Grischuk. Wow, Grishu. He made he is, some, uh, some wall, sort yeah. of a, a strange control with Bishop A5. <laughs> Looks very dicey, but maybe it's fine. Maybe it's very fine. Oh, yeah, he's looks, exchange up. Okay, I did not. Looks know. pretty strong to me. Queen A7, yeah. Queen A7 is coming now. I don't see after Queen A7 what to play. Okay, so now, oh, D5 he played. So some tactics he found. No, it's more like a. So basically, Magnus, he's acting an exchange at some point, rather desperately, I guess. It, yeah, now th that we think, yeah, the c3, the bishop on a5 is incredible, yeah? So it's a great yeah. defender, yeah? It's just defending very nicely. Yeah, it's defending and uh, controlling important squares. Mm -hmm. But Magnus, of course, he'll fight, so uh, it won't be easy, but... Uh, oh, time also, good. yeah? I mean... Okay, but it's Grishchuk, I mean, come on. Yeah. As Grishuk likes to say, uh, you know, if I deliver checkmate, uh, you don't need uh, you don't need the time when you can del deliver checkmate. So uh, as long as he's winning or probably winning, it's okay. But it's not so simple, maybe now, yeah. Just a second, I'll you come back. Mm -hmm. Sure. Somebody says, my wife is calling me. No, you think you heard my son. And he's not calling me. He's just refusing to sleep. Ah, okay. Do you have an easy time uh, getting your son to sleep? Very. I usually just sit in this room and then my wife uh, puts him to sleep. So in, for me, it's very easy. Ah, okay. No, the Aronian position was so exciting, which made me so excited that my you had to go off up, camera. Yeah? No, no, my parents got awake, I think. Mean. Oh. <laughs> oh, he takes a pawn. Which... 
Hari Krishna, yeah. I think Grishuk. Yeah, I probably both. I meant Grishuk, but sure. both did, both did. Yeah. But night is six. Okay. Oh, is it just winning? Like knight c7 is coming or what? Uh, I have in front of me. Uh... Your friend Ival Bar, yeah? No, I mean Grishuk and uh, Hare Krishna games. Ah, okay. And uh, knight c7 is there in uh, both the both, both of them. Yeah. Well, you know that uh, Grishuk kind of uh, his pieces are all on the a file. Look on the a7, a6, uh, a5, but they mm-hmm. are co. They are collaborating pretty well, yeah, from the yeah. side. Let's see what is incoming. Yeah, wow. uh, I think uh, Magnus really has to find something uh, that poses Out problem to... for Black. Something that's not there, yeah? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that is so bad. <laughs> yeah. No, but that's the problem, you know, that's the worst part. I can tell you that's when <laughs> you have a position where you feel that there might be something because of the screen pieces, you know, slightly uncoordinated queen on a7, knight on a6, bishop on a5, a little bit odd, yeah? So mm-hmm. you feel maybe there is something, but uh, yeah, there is nothing. Then, okay, you just lose. He will just lose all, all his time and then he will lose the game because there's not nothing simply. There's not nothing. But okay, I think uh, you just have to make moves that don't lose in such situations, yeah? And uh, Yeah, but that's where the challenge is. So which move doesn't lose, Tommy? Bishop f8. Knight c7. Queen d6. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that doesn't lose immediately. Knight b5, probably, yeah? Yeah, then some queen c6. Queen c6, queen b6. Ah, now I can... I can't... Okay. Uh, takes and uh, rook b8, knight c7, yeah? Uh, yeah. No, that's the thing that he... he yes, if he has... A, but that, I think if he had the move that doesn't lose immediately, he would not be completely lost. Problem is that he doesn't have such move. But maybe so find if one. he had a, such a move, he would have blitzed it out, yeah? yeah? Yeah. If he could, he would. But he can't, so he shan't. <laughs> there is the Sheldon. Sheldon I was uh, thinking Baggins. you... Yeah, Sheldon. Have you watched Young Sheldon, by the way? Uh, no. Actually not. I should. Probably it's fun. It's quite fun. Yeah. Oh, lucky Nepo! You know how he, ma- you know how he made the draw. He offered a draw. He offered it. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry for your joke, copying. <laughs> uh, thank you, Rajat. So I've reached seven thousand subscribers. Okay, so now we stop, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and you retire. You can retire. I think uh, I think I might consider retirement if I uh, reach ten thousand followers on Instagram. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. That is a bold statement. Well, how uh, many to follow? How many followers? Sorry, uh, ten thousand. Then you will what? Uh, I could consider retiring from social media. Yeah. Yeah. That doesn't make sense at all. But okay. No. What happens at ten thousand? Well, at least uh, I can start uh, giving links to my videos and stuff which I can't right now. Ah, okay, okay. It's a bit like Nihal reaching 3350 and retiring. <laughs> yeah, I can tell you there is no, uh, uh, you know, for me, there is no joy until I see I have more subscribers than we did. There is no joy, whatever number is there. Mm-hmm. So you are, so, I mean, you have your eyes set on the goal, yeah? Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, I can totally understand. I can, I also have uh, certain goals like that. <laughs> which you won't say, eh? like, <laughs> yeah, which I won't say now. Let's see how much subscribers we did has. I, I think, think he has he less than you. So I think uh, I think he had something like forty eight thousand, and you had like fifty five. No, sorry. Wait, you you speak about which which platform? Instagram. No, no. Oh, Instagram. YouTube. No, I meant you YouTube, YouTube. Ah. No, Instagram. Okay. No, Instagram. He's taking over me slowly, very slowly. Yeah. I'm on 54 and he is on, uh, he's much faster. He's on uh, 49. He's taking over me slowly. But I YouTube, mean. he's ahead and he's also going faster. So I can't catch him. But there is a secret answer to that. Yeah, I mean, very, very easy answer. Yeah. <laughs> become full Indian or? Yeah, exactly. I thought the same thing. Yeah, you become full <laughs> Indian and you get all the followers. 
Well, the thing is, uh, I could. I was thinking about it. Can and I actually, you India's, become India sorry, number one. This is what exactly. Can I can I say that I'm India's number one without being actually Indian? Mm -hmm. Like I, the thing is, I technically I would be India's number one if I was uh, Indian. So I could probably say it, but okay. Anyway, anyway. It's all not so important, guys. In general, all these likes and all this. Uh, but they do like the stream. Do like the stream. But in general, <laughs> all these likes and followers are absolutely irrelevant. Um, so if you subscribe to my channel, it's all good. <laughs> Otherwise, it's completely irrelevant. True. True. But so what are your hub? Yeah. What Go are ahead. your hub? Sports hobbies? Like, do you play anything besides chess? Uh, I liked uh, ping pong, table tennis. Yes, mm -hmm. yes. And but, are you uh, good at it? Yeah. Um. No, not exactly. But I, I'd say I trained very, very little. So I think I was reasonably, I was reasonably gifted at at ping pong. Reasonably gifted, let's say. Oh. But I uh, trained very, very little, and uh, so now I'm just, uh, I just like it. Just complete amateur, basically. Elephant is pretty good at it, I think. Gelfand, Leko, Motilov are also good. Um, Gelfand actually every week uh, is training, do you know? Yeah, yeah, yeah. He, he said he has some rating even, I mean. Wow. Wow. Yeah, no, I think, I think that, um, I think that, you know, I actually could, oh. but then my um, chess coach, she was much more uh, rough than the table tennis coach. Mm -hmm. And she, uh, she forced me to kind of, she kind of, uh, she kind of bullied my table tennis coach into uh, like sh she made me sort of quit table tennis because she said that I don't have enough time to do both and she said that okay uh, like I am really talented in chess so I should just stop this whole table tennis nonsense and uh, my table tennis coach was actually saying that I'm also pretty good but she was a bit softer so finally she gave in to the table tennis uh, to the chess uh, coach justice for table tennis coach yeah <laughs> <laughs> no but you know i would be fighting with all this uh, even if i would be let's say uh, very good or whatever that's uh, it's no chance because you'll be fighting with all the chinese you know they're yeah, all yeah. Chinese. malong is like completely crazy yeah but they're all chinese like you cannot i think there are so few uh, from europe or russia or there's only uh, one from europe who's like, unbelievably famous timo ball mm -hmm. i got a super chat saying that uh, nothing changes with she being number one so nothing changes. Uh, with she being number one, in India number always. one. Always. Uh, no, I mean by rating, I am higher than him. No, can't I? Yeah. 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 So that's his point. Yeah. Technicality can't change that. With she always number ah, one. Ah, like that, like that. Yeah. Soft spot. Ah, okay, okay, okay. Ah, interesting. So number one, uh, according to you, is not a, it's not a metric of uh, interesting uh, theory. But I guess it's always like this. It's like, no, but it's like, by, I mean, the definition of being number one is that you are number one, yeah? The definition of being number one on the list is that you are number one on the list. Like, it's kind of hard to argue that. Yeah, but, but I, sort of like uh, Life of Pi could be the, or sorry, Avatar could be the best movie of all time, but his or her favorite best could be Life of Pi. Mm -hmm. uh, hmm. Sorry, I don't get the reference there. Oh. Uh, maybe I should, okay, maybe uh, Titanic could be ah, the best I movie of all time, but some people like Pursuit of Happiness. I don't know, ah, I think no, it's no, like uh, Djokovic and Federer. I see, I see, I see, you just mean that it's, no, 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 but I mean that uh, there is a, no, no, this is what, I, what I'm saying. I mean, of course, Vichy is like six-time world champion. He's probably one of the uh, greatest players of all time, yeah? If not yeah, uh, yeah, the greatest. absolutely, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah. I mean, I don't speak of uh, legacy or I'm, I'm just saying that the, uh, the, ranking number is a literally is is it's a measurable unit yeah that has like there is rating and stuff like that there is i mean it's not something you can argue about yeah it's like let's yeah. say with movies there is no okay you can say let's say that some movie scores higher on imdb and that's it like oh yeah you made a, you make a very fair scientific point yeah, yeah i don't i don't mean to say that let's say someone who is ahead of vichy is better than him by no means i mean there is no one person nowadays yeah who is better than vichy but uh in terms of like uh so you can be higher ranked than Vichy and just just mathematical effect, yeah? It could be... But okay, Anish, uh, Anish, uh, we can have this yeah. conversation after you become full Indian, yeah? <laughs> uh, no, I would like to fight for my Indian number one spot currently, actually. <laughs> <laughs> no. Uh, I mean, opinions might work. change after you come here, yeah? No, but yeah. I don't say that... No, no, I mean, I don't say uh, even if I were... Of course, I would have not even close the achievements of Vichy, yeah? 
I mean, uh, I mean, not like not even like it's not even a talk here. I mean, uh, anything yet. There's like uh, my highest rank ever was uh, number two for uh, an hour or something. And uh, Vichy has been one for like uh, a few decades. So it's <laughs> yeah, it's true. Uh, meanwhile, by the way, our current number one in the world is uh, losing. Yeah, yeah, he's losing, and I I he's absolutely losing. don't see her completely lost. Again. Also, Hari Krishna is losing. Yeah, I mean, Anish called it. Yeah. Uh, Wait, Hari Krishna is losing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Wait, how? Zo, uh, the pawn is lost. Yeah, he calmly comes and takes on d6 and. Uh, like you, like d7. You play knight d6 and king c6. Yeah. Wow. Wasn't entirely clear that black is winning, but yeah, maybe. No, I think Wesley played a, a very nice game. Oh, Vishal says if we go like that, then uh, isn't Raja number one? No, but uh, <laughs> then uh, Magnus is India number one. Yeah, if you go like that, I mean. <laughs> <laughs> well, I think uh, Magnus has to reach uh, something like four million watch hours of Indians. Okay, I think My we have is collapsing. Yeah, we have pretty clear uh, results here yeah, in uh, all the games. Uh, Aronian beat uh, Domingos as expected, and uh, uh, it looks like uh, it looks like uh, Wesley is going to lead this portion. Yeah. Sorry, Wesley is leading. Yeah. Well, Wesley is going to win. Magnus is going to lose, and Wesley is one point behind Magnus. So, mm. wow, unbelievable! Yeah, he's going to take the lead, and and uh, I completely forgot about the blitz portion. For some reason, I thought it's ending uh, today. No, no. Then Hikaru will come back in blitz. Yeah, I remember this one time when uh, Vishy was. Uh, Completely out of form in uh, a Tata Steel, and uh, I mean uh, this uh, rapid blitz thing. And then the next day he turned up and uh, won the blitz, uh, tied with Hikaru and beat him in the tie break. Thanks to little Pragu, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Pragu was playing there. Yeah. I'm just trying to see if uh, Magus has any chances, but yeah, I don't he's think trying, yeah. Yeah, yeah, it, it starts to look like he has, but I think it's still an illusion. But uh, like optically, it starts to look like he has some chances already. Knight on e4, pawns are going forward. The know. problem is f4 is always running into rookie one. Oh, c4 is a bold. Yeah, also this uh, bishop on d4 kind of holds everything, no? Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's an illusion of counterplay, I guess. But there is an illusion already. There was no illusion, and now there is an illusion. Because uh, even, you know, even if black reaches uh, with the pawn on f2, white can just take bishop f2. Yeah, well, yeah, true. Because bd6 is trying to stir up some complications. I guess bishop g1 seals the deal, though, right? Bishop where? Bishop G1 seals the deal, right? Ah, yeah, yeah, I would imagine so. King E1, yeah? Mm -hmm. Yeah. King E7, you might even consider taking on D6 if you have time, but you don't have to. Yeah, just C5 and it should be over. Is So's position like so winning? <laughs> <laughs> Guys, it's that, that late, yeah, that you start making uh, Wesley So jokes. Okay, okay, cool. Uh, <laughs> okay, that's cool, that's cool. Yeah, 97, I think, uh, clinches it, no? Because of uh, because of 96. Uh, oh, yeah. yeah. I think that's actually a clincher. Uh, you win now, you, you cannot even trade B I for can I can play B7 and knight if I check. check. Oh, okay, yeah, but then king b6, king c5, I shoulder you. Uh, okay, you can play, let's say, knight oh, yeah, I, I'll, I'll shoulder, I'll just shoulder you, I guess. Yeah, you you can actually just play knight c5 check, king b4, and 
like to give knight d3 check and collect all the pawns yeah even also yeah also like that yeah no it's just oh just join king c5 no it's just lost it's just lost yeah yeah <laughs> Yeah, Vishal just made a super chat. Of course, of course, guys. Uh, we are just joking about the number one spot. Yeah. 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 No, Vishy is a legend, man. Hmm. No, seriously. Uh, uh, you know, you don't compare people who are, uh, uh, you know, who, in terms of uh, legacy. It's like they're, you know, those who have who have won so many world championship titles, like Vishy. Yeah. You know, that's that's the biggest measure of all. Yeah, I'm also yeah, going yeah. to make this comparison, which Anish might actually understand this time around because he has met Virat Kohli, <laughs> I guess. So yeah. it's a bit like people come, like people sometimes saying like Virat Kohli is the best, but yeah, Virat said that yeah, Sachin is the god. Like, and at least in India, Sachin is considered to be the god of cricket. Like, mm -hmm. really. Yeah, I don't know. I think in in terms of chess, it's easier to understand that Vishy is a legend because he just won the. I don't know how it is in cricket because you're a member of a team and stuff. But in chess is an individual sport. Vishy, he just won World Championship title individual mm -hmm. once, like six times. So then, okay, it's just. Uh... And Sachin has made hundred centuries. Like, mm -hmm. wow. Actually, I am actually a big time sports lover. I actually play all the sports. I play. Table tennis at a pretty good level. I play mm -hmm. football like maybe sixteen, seventeen hundred. Mm -hmm. Yeah, jack of all, master of none. <laughs> well, uh, you're uh, T shaped in sports, yeah. T shaped. Yeah. Are we Are we going there again? <laughs> <laughs> it's a, It's a T shape. Yeah, it's a, it's a thing that uh, Srinath is very proud of. He's yeah. uh, T shape. But uh, yeah, uh, no, actually, the vicious uh, competition in terms of uh, his legendariness, uh, that's Gary Kaspar of Magnus Carlsen, probably. Um, yeah, and, and who else? I, mean, I don't know, some kind of Emmanuel Lasker or, you know. People this... do say Fisher. People, I mean... Yeah, Fisher, but Fisher, uh, in terms of uh, World Championship titles, he. Uh, I mean, yeah, exactly. Okay. Uh, like, if you, if you go by the title, I mean, if you go by World Championship titles, yeah, I guess that. Uh, Kasparov did many years, uh, many matches, right? And Magnus yeah. also already. Magnus is catching up. Yeah, he did already. He won a few matches already. How many times? I don't know. Three, four. It's more, more I think. Twice. Vichy twice. Karakin and no four matches, right? Yeah, four, four yeah. matches. Yeah, four matches. And Vichy, I think, is for six times. By the way, uh, you trained no, with Vichy. No, Vichy is when five. You were... Five, yeah, five. Mm -hmm. You trained with Vichy when you were pretty young, no? Uh, yeah, very briefly, very briefly, yeah. And uh, how 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 did it go? If you can talk about it. Uh, yeah, it was. Uh, I would say it was a very, very, very useful for me, of course. But uh, I, the thing is, he was. Uh, I was supposed to try to help him a little bit for the World Championship match, but I really couldn't help uh, at all. Maybe I did uh, to give him confidence. Maybe I, it gave him some confidence. He saw, you know, how much better he is than me and all that. Right. Also, Carlson we... worked a lot mm -hmm. with Gary, right? Uh, yeah, and Carlson actually worked with Vichy at the time as well a lot. Mm -hmm. yeah, uh, yeah, yeah, I remember. But uh, how was it like? Uh, were you supposed to uh, just play a lot of games with him, or uh, yeah, mostly stuff? play? And uh, and while we would play, we would of course uh, touch upon critical lines and sort of uh, uh, share some uh, information. But let's say the first time, I just I, I didn't have anything, you know, like they were like five steps ahead of me everywhere. Mm -hmm. And then the second uh, the second time, also I could barely contribute. Uh, in terms of openings, but uh, yeah, I th I think I would have been a lot more useful later. But I was no I was no longer uh, I no longer worked with him after that. Right. I was not invited really anymore. So, and uh, was there was there a huge uh, disparity in the hardware you used compared to what the other guys were using at the time? Uh, with the computer yeah yeah, yeah yeah the first time for sure and uh, not only the hardware but in general the i didn't really un understand the i didn't have the right approach you know i, I was too young right i was it was it was much harder to work on openings than now because now it's much easier because the engines are so much stronger back then the human input and the navigation of it was still a lot more important to you know to pick right direction but it's still become more interesting, no? With all this uh, Leela and Fat Fritz, I mean, lots of engines. Um, I don't know. I think I don't think now it's that much more interesting because, uh, well, let's say before there was a lot more unexplored territory in the openings. 
uh, now I think you revisit the same places no, over and over, don't you? Mostly. Right. At least for me. I mean, I don't know. At least for me, I very rarely find something completely new. Like mm -hmm. I just revisit the stuff. I mean, I, I know some stuff that is not yet shown, let's say. Mm -hmm. But uh, it's very rare that I find something completely new somewhere. Yeah, for example, before in Poison Pond, if you find a very good idea, you just win out of the opening. And whereas now, everyone has a quite extensive idea of how things work. Yeah, and most of these ideas were already played. So it's uh, now it's much more about trying to find something that the opponent has forgotten about. Or, you know, yeah, 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 yeah. But it's still, still, it's, still, it's still definitely very interesting, but it's, it's a little bit different now. I think now also it's very hard to memorize stuff. Before, you didn't have such problem. Mm-hmm. Also, before everybody would follow the same thing. So, for example, if I played the Petrov, everybody would play uh, one line, this main line, five ninety three, and all my games would go down this line. Right. I just had to analyze that line, and that's it. And now, like, if I play the Petrov, they will play this line, that line, that line, that line. Uh, you know, Srinath, you did great thing. You should talk about Vishu more times because you are now <laughs> massively, yeah, massively three super chats, yeah, massively cashing in. Yeah, yeah, I know. <laughs> But uh, I do agree with you, Geek. Yeah, yeah. I do agree even with you. Like, and if even... you, for example, uh, saw the Indian uh, team press conference, it was uh, a lot. It was pretty much all about Vishy, you know. Vishy, uh, everyone uh, centering around him. Actually, I, I just remembered this line that we were talking that before people used to find ideas which were unexplored. Do you remember? Does, does anyone recall this Bishop T8 move which Gary had? Uh, which uh... in in some Nashdorf like bishop g5 like king is on e8 and then bishop d8 comes oh Shinat, no you know no 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 but I was just thinking that uh, this has become an opening clinic of sort yeah with Anish but it has to be no <laughs> yeah yeah I mean it's uh, Shinat, it cannot be movie review every day yeah. Uh... <laughs> Yeah, but I yeah, think no. the games are finished, right? The games are yeah, finished. Yeah, the games are finished. Uh, so Hari lost, Magnus lost, and uh, yeah, I think we have the end of the rapid uh, rapid portion. Did you say portion or portion? Portion. Sorry, rapid portion or rapid portion? A uh, rapid portion. Portion, okay, because we did, he says portion, yeah, instead of, po instead of position. Yeah, I think I also have a similar accent. Uh, uh, we How do make, you say uh, I think, I think, uh, I think in general, uh, at least I, I make a lot of pronunciation mistakes because I used to read a lot. And, uh, you know, uh, when you read a lot and you don't uh, talk as much, you have this pronunciation problem, yeah? Oh, very nicely said. Yeah, that's true. Wow. And uh, for a long time, I was I was not even uh, aware of how many mistakes I used to make until I visited oh, Frederick. Oh, Fred uh, Frederick bullied you, yeah? Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, Frederick is, is known for that. <laughs> no, but we did. I the thing is, I don't know. I used to think that uh, it's an uh, Indian, uh, some kind of Hindi accent to say poison, yeah. But then they told me that it's just a Vidit thing. It's not like an Hindi thing at all. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, uh, the chat pointed out that uh, I also say it the same way. Potion. Potion. No, well, it's hard. It's hard. It's hard. Yeah, it's hard to say. It's hard to say. Anyway, the actually, the Vidit's English is so much better than mine. Sometimes he, I always make fun of his expressions. Yeah. Uh, but then I, he tells me always that to Google and then I Google them and it turns out that they're correct. He uh, Vidit this, reads uh, a lot. Vidit reads a lot. Uh, super chats, yeah, mostly. <laughs> <laughs> okay, guys, uh, uh, crowd demands tendings, so I propose tendings and uh, yeah, yeah, I have it on my uh, screen. Nice. There you go. So Wesley is leading with uh, 13 points. I need to make this a bit small. Yeah, 
yeah wesley is leading with 13 points and uh, magnus with 12 and uh, hari krishna is at the fifth place yeah mm. yeah he's at the fifth place ali reza and domingo is struggling a bit and nepo despite his uh, two uh, it domingo is really Wow. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sorry, but what what are the score system they use? It's completely confusing. It's uh, two points for win, one for draw, and zero for uh, loss. And then in the blitz, it's the normal one zero point five. Ah, that, that's quite simple then. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. No, Wesley is just uh, wow, nice. He's just you know a smooth criminal, basically very smooth criminal. <laughs> yeah, yeah. But uh, I was just talking about uh, this with Harshit when you are not around. Do you think uh, Wesley is a bit too intimidated by Magnus? But. Um... sometimes sometimes not the thing is wesley's playing style mm-hmm. uh it is quite well suited for being intimidated right like even when he's not intimidated he plays as though he's intimidated a little bit like he's uh i think it's a bit similar to nihal uh, the closest comparison no. i can make you think so yeah i think so mm. wow I don't know. I d- actually haven't seen that many Nihal games. Maybe George Meir. Yeah, George Meir comes to mind. Yes, for example, no, Wesley. He is um, now. The thing about Wesley is that he is capable of playing very sharp chess. Mm-hmm. But uh, he okay. It depends. Some very often he. The, the thing is that even if he's intimidated, he will still play very very well at defense. Mm-hmm. And then uh, if he gets a counter chance, usually it's uh, without risk, and he will take it also. So like he plays so well at defense that it's okay to be intimidated, you know, for him. Yeah. Yeah. So it's hard to say sometimes, he, but also he actually beat Magnus in the Fisher random, yeah. So it's not like. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. True, true. He just does more of what he makes him happy. Uh yeah yeah no but actually Wesley is <laughs> no, uh, I think I, you saw what I, I did there. No, I, I see I see what you did there. I know I know I see what you did there. Uh, but uh, actually Wesley is. Uh, kind of often underestimated because he has a signature style but he can also play very sharp if if sometimes if a uh, position requires it and he also has uh, good periods and bad periods and I uh, shouldn't uh, Wesley is I think one of the one of the uh, most gifted players around yeah he's definitely in the top 10 yeah, uh, yeah, yeah. top 10 the worst case 20 of the world but uh, usually top 10 sometimes he was also he had the streak when he was winning every wow, wow. number 2 right was... It was brilliant. Twenty-eight thirty was, I think. Yeah, yeah, he played just amazing. And then was your pet streak, right? Somebody says his style similar to Vidit. That's true. Yeah, very similar to Vidit. Oh, yeah. Very sim. Yeah, I think his style is very similar to Vidit. Yeah. Sometimes we think so deep that we miss the easy. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah. Okay. So uh, Anish. Uh, But Vidit it... has more YouTube subscribers. So uh... <laughs> it's, it's all. It's all. It's take. You know. It's all give and take. So. Yeah. Hi, I'm Arshit. Is so interesting. Uh, bring him here more often. Well, uh, as much as the uh, University of Mizzou lets him be with me, I would. Yeah. <laughs> so no, Anish, it's uh, a huge pleasure. Yeah. Absolutely. Uh, likewise for me as well. Yeah, thank you guys. It was a lot of fun. Yeah, always. yeah, yeah. Thanks a lot. Yeah, thank you for the training games. I come, of course, for the training games. Yeah, you know. <laughs> <laughs> I come. I'm the rest. I'm just, uh, you know, I'm just passing the time, yeah. and um, you know, all this uh, uh, making fun of uh, all other players. But mostly, I'm just waiting for this uh, training game. So thank you for that. Yeah. Uh, yeah. See you guys tomorrow. Yeah. Yeah. Thank See you. you very much. Bye bye. Bye bye.